I'm like, yo, what's up? What's up, bitches? Fly on your okay, yeah, and I'll be like, there's a fly on me. No, I have a fly on me. I'll tell them that. And the crowd's gonna <laughs> no, love what it. What the fuck? What are you talking about? Why is he here? Ah! <laughs> I'm Johnny Knoxville. Welcome to Jackass. Alpha, one, two, three. Ah! <laughs> God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. It's so clean. Yeah. It looks oh, like, a, man. like a cow udder now. Oh, oh, five, oh. <laughs> That's great. Dude. Oh, that is so much hair. Wait, can I make a request? This hurts so much. Oh, can we, can my we God. set them all aside to take a photo after? Is that possible? Uh, oh, yeah, you can just keep it somewhere. That is gross, though. <laughs> Dude, you have so much hair now that's not there. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, it's really, <laughs> oh, it's really <laughs> it's smooth. So, what's up, guys? This is uh, welcome to the yard, and this is uh, Lana. She she runs a studio called Wax by Lana. You want to say hi? Let me take off my mask and say hi, Hello, everyone. Right here, you right here. <laughs> First of all, I would like to thanks to thanks uh, Anthony and his team. Give me this opportunity. Oh, man, that's us. We're Anthony's team. I would like to say thank you to all my clientele. Um, they've, they've been showing like their support and love me for many years. Without them, what's by Lana? It's not like today. Oh. I love hearing and that. And now we're part of that everyone, loving clientele. For everyone who needs any part of the body waxing, give me a try. I can guarantee... <laughs> I won't let you guys down. <laughs> I mean, I'm no, like, disappointed. Use, use code right, YARD you. for... Uh, <laughs> what? Oh, dude. So a funny thing about Lana here is that... So I, I was tasked to find a, you know, a place to get this done, right? For yeah, because not only do you have to do it, but you have to find the, the person. Yeah, because, you know... Oh, God. It's, <laughs> and the funny thing here is I just like... I Google searched and I, and I just found her. And I, I give her a call. And we start talking about it and stuff. And then uh, and she's like, okay. And she seems down. I'm like, oh, this is great. She's like super down. Uh, we have another call. And she's, oh, she's like. <laughs> what, what What was that noise for? Oh, my God, Why are you making noises? Okay. Yeah, for audio listeners, Slime just like, he actually just stepped on like a little thing. And he's like, <laughs> yeah, he he's on, like, like a big like, baby about it. Little, it wasn't he, even a Lego. It just looks like a Lego. Oh, and yeah. he's treating it's it like. It's actually just a, a piece of fuzz. He's yeah. Like, and he freaking was, out. And she actually have. And he had, went. Uh -huh. She actually has done this for Eric Andre. Which is kind of funny. Yeah, that was wild. Yeah, because because you functionally just found like what was the first result for you, and, yeah, we, and then crazy. you had well, worked on Eric Andre. What this means is you and Eric Andre did the same thing, which was like needing waxing and then going, oh, I'll Google it then, and then just <laughs> yes. going to the first result and being like, the works they call, for they, me. they call that Sasquatch Brothers. That's what that's called. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This already sucks so bad. Well, I, I can't believe the amount of time she said it was going to take because we're blazing through the chest. Yeah. Well, I don't think the dude, chest got, is the hard got, part. You got a whole peck done right now. Legs are, so legs are going to take dude. so long. The legs are going to take a while. Do you think there's some people who are confused why we're doing this? No. Almost certainly. What? Almost well, certainly. You guys have to kiss now. Normal. Or you disagreed. Wow, we disagreed? Dude, yeah. what's the no. you've, been, you've been weird lately. You've been weird. Fuck you on that table. Well, no. okay. Well, it's the first two minutes of the YouTube video. We have to blur Dude, that now. welcome back to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going, Jeff? So we, we made a promise that... Wait, uh, this is a big strip. Oh! oh! Straight line like Mr. McKegg. Oh, it's <laughs> uh, a great rip. <laughs> <laughs> you are getting so red where she's ripping. Uh, it's so funny because you, you look so baby smooth, dude. This looks <laughs> it actually oh, is really look. smooth. I've waxed my leg. It's smoother than shaving. Like it's not even close. <sighs> Feels great. Yeah. So we uh, we made a promise to the Patreon uh, that at twenty thousand of y of y'alls, we would uh, wax his whole body and make him a little nice little otter for us. So oh, <laughs> the yards only drug people. Uh, look again, atheists. Yeah. Yeah. So we have range. Checkmate. Okay. Uh, we're making our hairy friend less hairy. Uh huh. Uh, I'm gonna be the smoothest little bear that ever was you guys <laughs> i feel like arms are gonna hurt pretty bad uh, i uh, well i mean she said the most painful area is doing your dick and butt yeah which we're nah, gonna do nah, which we're gonna do fine. which we're gonna, do. We're gonna do you get we probably won't show you his dick and butt probably i, I don't feel, know i feel like the pain centers of this would be similar to tattooing it's it's so much more intense. Do you know, do you know no, no, not sorry i should clarify i don't think it's as painful as tattooing i think that the places it would hurt the most would be <sighs> the same places oh uh, as tattooing. I think nipple hurts. Oh, it's God. hard. It's okay. You're good. <laughs> you're just doing your job. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you're... You sound like... I'm not going to say that. Uh. But... <laughs>
Yeah. Uh, sounds like Shaggy. This is Slime's voice line if he was in Melee and he goes off the top. Uh, <laughs> uh, give me a yow. <laughs> <laughs> the tongue. Oh man, look at your chest. That's a done chest. Oh, you're yeah. bleeding. I know. Yeah, I it's a little bloody spots. Yeah. The wow. little blood spots will come yeah. out. So uh, we don't just do drugs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We we have uh we have this. I'm not sure what pain the next... is also kind of a drug. If you well, think the next about one, it. It, 25k patrons. We're gonna try to make Aiden not cringe. We're gonna we're gonna remove a finger from Aiden. I don't think we should hand, overpromise. Like in Mission Impossible 2. We're gonna cut off Aiden's foreskin. <laughs> Live on stream. An adult bris. circumcision at 25 k <laughs> No, it'll be ceremony. It'll be a bris. Call it what it is. Yeah. <laughs> and we'll keep the bris on. We'll keep the foreskin on set. The yeah. Extra skin. It'll, it'll be, you know, how, like how some parents will keep their umbilical cords from their babies. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Like that. Yeah. You know, that's that's freak, I, I learned about this guy yesterday who he had to get like his leg cut off because he had like leg itis or whatever and right. uh and they cut off his leg and he was like hey i'm religious and i have to be buried whole so you have to give me my leg and they're like oh yeah we do so they gave him his leg and then instead he wasn't religious he made tacos out of the leg <laughs> oh. and then all of his friends ate him in taco <gasps> really and they did it somehow legally that's tight uh, and i found out about that and then i was thinking would y'all eat me if i was a taco if you were down <laughs> what like you are okay with this yeah i'm saying boys this is sort the of like is the, <laughs> this is like the the lads version of would you still love me if I was a worm? Right. Yeah, kinda. Yeah. Would, would my boys still eat me if I was taco meat? Yeah. <laughs> I, so I'm wondering. Like, and we say no, and he's like, dude, what the heck, man? So like, I, come I, on. You guys come home, and I'm like, boys, I made tacos. You're like, oh, cool, we're <laughs> you all don't hungry. have a leg. That's sweet. I don't have. You're like, no, What's... you're just hidden behind a counter. <laughs> you're like leaning over it. <laughs> uh, yeah. So you guys. Taking bites? I, I would. I would a hundred percent eat any part of you. Would you, you go? Were. Would you go raw, or would you want like seasoning? I would definitely raw? get it cooked. No, not raw. Sorry, I meant like, would you want seasoning, mm. or do you want it plain? A, and I, a nice blue Nick steak. <laughs> I don't. I, I think I would have like one little cube by itself just to try it, just to know what it's like. A little, right. a little Versillo tartare. Uh huh. Like, can you, you like, can you get like a disease? Like this, this is how mad cow disease works. This is how Probably. COVID started. No, because I'm not a cow, and that makes you sound stupid. No, because yeah. mad cows started. eat other cow meat. Maybe I eat it, and then I become cringe and want to wear skinny jeans. Wait, is it hurt? It hurts when she puts the wax on because it's still pulling the hairs. Oh. And there's also the anticipation of what this is going to be like. Oh, right? man. But yeah, because it, it pulls the hairs as she, she puts the wax on. I got to know. You gotta You're full... like the 32-year-old virgin right now. Yeah. Yeah. That was real, by the way. When they did that, he was really getting that those uh, you know those shots done. Respect. You, you got a full tattoo. <sighs> yeah. How, what is the pain from that to this? It was. It's not even close. I'm not kidding. This is so way worse. So considerably worse. On my tattoo, when I got part of it on the bicep, uh, that was pretty painful. But it was kind of like, it, it. It's weird to say, but it's kind of like a nice pain. Ah, because it's kind of like constant and like. This is just more like aggressive and like evil. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. This. So is, you wouldn't call this a nice pain. This is not. Oh. oh! This is not nice. Oh, at all. that hair that was so thick. Lana, oh. can I ask you a question? Is it normal for someone to get their full body all in one day? Yeah. That's normal? Yeah. Do they usually like whine this much and cry this much? <laughs> Come on, dude. Right. I never seen anyone crying. Okay. Well, what? I haven't what? cried yet. Yeah. I haven't cried yet. Uh, so. you're, you're, you're and, I'm not, and I'm not close, by the way. I know. You're like, you like cry, man? <laughs> you're like, yeah. cry, man? <laughs> you're Dawson. You, can you yeah. wax no, your Bam face? Margera. Like, can you do this on your face? I'm not saying you should, but I feel like your face would hurt so bad. Are we doing the mustache today? No, it's face, neck down. Neck yeah, down. we clarified. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not doing no. that. It's a terrible idea. No. <sighs> Then you said four weeks of cotillion and I get a call. Wait, 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 wait. Are we doing pits? We're, cotillion. <laughs> we're not this skipping pits, are we? We're not skipping pits. No? Pits go? Hey, pits are neck down, boys. We're, yeah. taking, a, we're taking a pit you know stop. I, we're taking a butt stop. You know what I can't I, I am. Actually, no. I guess you can't skip anything. I was going to say you could skip the arms, but I guess there's there's no skipping. There, it's. It, I mean, that's not what it said in the Patreon description. That's right. You know, and I'm and a man we, of my word. Dude, I'm looking at your legs right now. So I actually you have never thought about how much hair you have on your body. I've never, I've never noticed it. But now that I'm seeing it go away, I'm like, There's you so got much. so much down There's there. There's so yeah. much. There's a lot. The legs there. are going to take so long. You got dude. full thighs. I'm a smooth bear. <laughs> I'm going to be a smooth uh, bear. I'm going to be a smooth bear. bear. Gonna be smooth smooth bear. bear. One, two, hurt. three. Smooth bear. Ah. Ooh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. This. Ow. 
This podcast as an audio experience must be so weird. Oh my because- god, this is gonna be the worst audio episode of all time. Yeah, they're not gonna know that there's about to be a poll. They're just gonna occasionally hear. Ah, we should just release this one on Thursday, bro. <laughs> yeah. It's skip Wednesday. If you're an audio listener, hey man, hey, how's the drive? <laughs> Crash the car right now. Do it. Go into your impulses. Turn right. Turn right. I know you're thinking about it. Uh, don't do that. Unless, of course, you are turning right into a right lane. In which case, you yeah. Can. So you know what else happened in the week, boys? Yeah, <laughs> Anthony uh, can't be our driver because he's in immense pain. Yeah. So we gotta take over. We just did Beyblades, and Aiden's a fucking shit ref. I'm yeah, a great ref. I'm just I'm hanging out with my friends. I'm rock climbing. I'm having a good time. Uh, I start getting all these death threats. And I'm like, what is going on? What's why am getting I getting death threats? There are people who are like, you're the worst fucking ref ever. I want to fucking hurt you and kill you. Suck. Wow. I'm like, whoa. Uh, but they're also saying things like, but I like the hair though. So I'm like, people usually say that in like conjunction with a DM. Yeah. So I'm like, Weird. <laughs> so, a lot of nice so I couldn't DMs. parse that this was about someone else as a joke, you know? Because normally, like they might, if, let's say slime did this, like they'd be like, LMAO, you're bald in your DMs. Yeah. But mm-hmm. they weren't doing that. So I was like, what did I do? Yeah. And I'm looking around. I can't figure out what I've done. Uh, turns out Aiden did something. Yeah, it was a little call to action. Uh huh. So I, I was refing the the whole day. Cutie, for those who don't know, hosted a Beyblade tournament with about 32, 32 various Sorry, YouTubers to, and streamers. They yeah. paid, they paid and for uh, she they asked did. me to be the referee, which I was excited about. Uh, and we did it in like a full like boxing training center. Mm-hmm. There was a boxing ring where we actually had the competition. And uh, I turns out calling Beyblade matches is actually surprisingly hard because sometimes they don't. Sometimes they both stop at like the same time. It is which an I was eye not, test, which I was not prepared for. And I had to make a bunch of calls where I was like, "I'm, you know what? I'm not really sure, but I think that one stopped first. Oh. But I didn't say that, so I'm just making a call. The crowd and has the camera. Every though. time there's a close call. Somebody is upset. Sorry, by the call. hold up. Um, you're making yourself look like you're a good ref. He was fucking terrible. Oh, yeah. yeah. I wasn't fucking terrible. No, hold on. Were. The three times, because th- we started doing video replays, you would pull it up. The three times you did that, my call was correct. Here's the, the thing. The replay enforced my call. Hey, I'm a- the one that Aiden, had to pull the video replay. You could have done that. Waylon instead of Aiden. So we call him that. Amen. Yeah. I would say that you were dog shit because you refused to give out ties until like the top eight. And oh, then you were like... because there weren't any ties. No, so, there no, were. Okay, there, there, was were. This, there was this part where Aiden really fucked up and not because he made the wrong call, but because it was really close and he could have realistically said it's 1-1 for the hype, but he didn't. This is because that... Aiden never played Halo oh. and he never had to be in a double beat down and know what that's like. Uh, and that was the part where I was like, he's not built for this job because he his job is actually to make it more exciting like a basketball ref. But he's like, he's being a stickler about which one fell first, which contradicted his earlier calls in which he wasn't sure. So it's like, well, now you want to be a stickler. Why not our, just be a Our ref man? is wavy. Uh-huh. The rule set's changing. Also, the ref, the ref sucked because... Because he Why? looks stupid. <laughs> did, you, did you say let him rip? Did you ever say that? I sa- I had to say it every single time. That's awesome. Yeah, you know, it was the, three, let it, two, one. Let it rip for every single game of every single match. Yeah, and then I would ring the the boxer and then bell. Ring the bell. <laughs> yeah. it was, so it was Ding. me. And, so Rich Campbell was supposed to be my like co commentator. Also, sounds like a white I'm, rapper. I'm beefing with Cutie because she came unprepared. She literally could have brought two mic cables and two of these mics. And we would have had like great like poker commentary, but she's like, "Oh, you guys will use labs," and I'm like, mm. "That's insane." But it worked out fine. I was actually really surprised that it came out so well. I think were you guys was, moving around? No, we were just static. Yeah, it was a bad idea, but I, I don't blame her. It's oh fuck, and it was like, and uh, but Dude, can I add to this really quick before you continue? The other day, Cutie is, Cutie's in the in the living room and she's like freaking out. She's so she's so stressed about something. She's fucking with a camera. And she's like, this like I'm like, what's up? You, you all good? She's like, this camera has just been broken, and like I can't find like any resources to like figure out what's wrong with it. And I'm looking online, like no one can help me. And I'm like, I live here. <laughs> like, I'm like, how long have you been doing this? She's like, three days. I'm like, I live here. Was it her? Was it her kitchen stream camera? Yeah. Yeah, she's I, been struggling. And then yeah, I, went, I fixed the problem in like 30 seconds. <laughs> well, she doesn't really? want to bother you. She's not like, Atriac will DM you. Emergency! There's a middle Ari's going to die if There's you don't <laughs> fix this now. Look, Atriac does do that, but he is just on the other side of the spectrum of stupid. There, There is a middle ground here where it's just like, oh, do you know what's wrong here? And I'm like, oh, that's my thing. I do. Yeah. Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. I, people love being experts at things, especially if they are. Oh, fuck me. Oh, we're going to pit one, pit by the town, way. Pit town, hold up. We're, we're going to break. tomato town? Oh, we're going to oh, pit break. So, so big, oh, right. sloppy Girls wax. do this all the time, so I have no reason to fucking complain. Yeah, because you think that you're stronger. I d- I'm then just saying that's what you that, think like, about that. If you ever think, like, if you're like, oh, girls, whatever, like, they're, they ain't shit. 
They literally do this. <laughs> And it's crazy. Women who get waxed are stronger than our Marines. They're stronger than actual Marines, unless they're girl Marines that get waxed also. It goes, it goes, uh, <laughs> it goes dream viewers, women who get waxed, Marines. Well, Marines who get, well, Marine women who get waxed. Marine, Marine about, women who get waxed, yeah. Marine women who get waxed that watch Dream. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> the, the ultimate. And, yeah, and, that, then, and then Prezzo. There's like, two, yeah. <laughs> there's like two of those women and they're on Delta Force And then now. Pre Prezzo's ability to not be canceled is the next uh, proof thing. No. All he does is he was. All he says is he just wants to like smash Maya's pussy into the dirt, <laughs> and he gets away with it because he's gay. And yeah. it's like, okay, sure. It's amazing I guess. the the leash that he has. <laughs> he can't get away with shit. I I got Maya was like, I, she called me racist yesterday. Really? Uh, yeah, because I walked up to her at the Beyblade event and I went unknowingly just like I went mushy moo. <laughs> Which is hello in Japanese? No, no, it's not. It's, also it's not. like a, it's like a, it's like a phone greeting. It's the phone greeting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. that's fine. I, he's oh, close that's enough cute. with hello. That's cute. We, we, if you want to specify, yeah, you would never say that to a person. What if I came up to you and said howdly doodly? Is that the same yeah, tier? That, that is that's racist. Not the, that is racist. That's, it's the same because that's what that's they Canadian say. Canadian racist. That's it. <laughs> that's it. They go howdly doodly. Welcome to <laughs> Tim Hortons. So can, can I only, get you? You can only say that if you're from rural Alberta. <laughs> I'm I'm nervous for this one for him. Oh. 50,000 people used to live here. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't want <laughs> to count. I don't want to count. He doesn't know how to count. That's yeah. what he's trying to he's say. He's never right done now. it before. Yeah, anyway, the Beyblade event went pretty well. Uh, I didn't, I didn't, yeah, that's I, what hey, isn't that bad, hey, actually. I, I got us to game 10, didn't I? Well, you know what's <laughs> fucked up is that Will Neff shows up. He drives in. He's playing the pain theme song from Naruto that goes... Oh, 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 oh. Like as he drives up? Yeah, yeah. yeah like and, a he's in, and in a Kotsky uniform. I, and he's wearing the villain's costume from Naruto. He comes out of his car and he's wielding two Beyblades he bought. He calls up a store in Little Tokyo and he goes, hey, do you guys have like any Beyblades? And the woman goes, is this about the drop? And he's like, what? And he's like, what? Oh, the, oh, the off-white X Beyblades? <laughs> the <And> Bape? <laughs> the Beyblade? Yeah. She's like, well, yeah, the Friday, the Friday drop. Are you, like, interested in that? And he's like, uh, absolutely I am. She's like, I can put your name down. It's going to be, like, a 30-minute line. So he shows up to this drop, and he gets some goaded Beyblade. Really? Ba Beyblade. I didn't know he had, Dude, what? It's just not just a standard, oh, oh, like... you're looking at me confused like a son of a so, bitch. So he gets you this, stupid right? piece of shit. Well, you're the referee. Now, Slime, Slime's anger is valid, because what happens is he's talking about how he's, he's going to be the villain. He's uh -huh. coming to this device, and, uh, and he's telling Cutie, and Cutie's like, no, you're not. You're not doing this, because she purposefully got the shittiest Beyblades on the market. Yeah, yeah she got base decks. Plastic, rinky-dink... You know, it, so that nobody could sweat too hard and nobody could min max. Yeah, bring out the Mad Cats Bay Beyblades. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Actually, she was like, "I want to run a melee tournament, but I want everyone to use a Mad Cats controller. Yeah, that way no one's that good." Yeah. And then Will Neff shows up with a box. Yeah. And we're like, "Wait, what? <laughs> you, yeah, you can it, instant turn around and, and, and his, <sighs> his shit come with with free pussy. It got a Starbucks in it. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and 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 he starts using it. And he the also, ref dude, he also had this launcher on deck. So the normal rippers are just a plastic piece with a cord that goes through, and they're kind of shitty, and you just pull it out, yeah. right? But he brought two that are th like this machine that almost is like a fucking lawnmower cord. Whoa. And you pull it, and it it spins like fucking five times as fast. And that was, did he and use that the whole time? No, so, no, he oh. didn't use it for like the first half of the tournament, and then it, he started handing it out to people. Like towards I hate the how second you're half. talking about this like a bystander and not the referee yeah, that that force the up. rules. But it, it looks stock. It was sick, so he the starts cheating. The thing the about tournament. it is, it looks stock to me. Here's so, the conversation. Uh, <laughs> here's the conversation I, I had with like Cutie. I was like, Will's gonna cheat, and she goes, Oh no, I think Aiden will take care of it. Like maybe they'll wrestle or something. What happened is Will goes in for his first match with the fucking giant ass Beyblade, and looks at Aiden. Aiden goes, Yeah, that looks stock. Shakes his hand. And then it will proceeds to win the entire fucking event. He did win the whole thing, which is a terrible look. That is for the, awesome. For the association. For the, it looks great for Beyblade. Let it rip, by the way. And no, everybody no, it else looks bad for the association. I think it was a clean game, honestly. I, I don't really You're think there, there's fucking any Because I fucking lost to him, and I spent hours building but, Coots oh, my Beyblade. Imagine, oh, imagine you're at Beyblade, right? And you're like... And you're, you're, let's say you're a potential buyer, and you're like, well, I spend more money. Are these things even going to get me more wins? And then you watch a guy win a whole tournament with one. That's a good it's point. That's good for it's Beyblade. It's time I revealed to all of you that I was indeed paid off by Big oh Beyblade. Oh, my God. <laughs> by, Big Blade. By the, by the drop. No, mm -hmm. okay, so to, another another way I personally got fucked was that uh, there because it, we started late because of this microphone issue, uh, which isn't that the issue. Things start late all the time. We started late. Um, 
is that it was like running low on time. So we, we changed it. So losers bracket became a best of one. And that oh. happened in the middle of like basically losers. And I, I, I was actually in the bracket because we needed people to fill. And my match against Ovali, I won the first one. And then I lost the best of three. And then the, oh, fuck. And then the rule <laughs> changed like right after. And so I kind of I got fucked. Same you, thing for me. I good? lost to Will yeah. Neff and I won game one. <laughs> yeah. And so, but you know what? We take it in stride as competitors because the Beyblade rules change sometimes, and that's that. You know? That's the way it works in Beyblade tournaments. You never know when it's going to be best of one or best of three. It's kind of an <laughs> on-the-spot call. If you did any research or talked to the association ahead of time, I you would have known that. Dude, to the, that's my to fault. the audio listeners, it just sounds like you're getting an HJ at dinner ah, under the table. Part? Yeah, and you're like, you're like, I, I just saw uh, you know the Beyblade, <clears throat> and then I. <clears throat> It's like a shitty porn this where he's getting head under what, the table. Yeah. This is what you're going to sound like when we do the remote vibrator thing. <laughs> yeah, true. Uh, except, the, except the aggressive one. Okay, but by the way, guys, she did my armpit like a couple of pulls ago, probably like three, four minutes ago, and it actually didn't hurt that bad. Yeah, it, so it looked, looked like you were just like, yeah, oh. It, the, the armpit was okay. It seems like upper arms and uh, forearms are kind of tough, though. Yeah, the, this is going to hurt, this this forearm right here, because it's, it's like fine hairs, kind of, I think. But... Uh, yeah, the armpit, I was surprised, did not hurt too much. Um, I also asked Lana, I was like, "Do I should I shave like my privates before this? And she was immediately like, no, 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 no. So I think that means it's going to be a little easier. Is that shit a jungle right now? No, it's not really a jungle. It's probably like a month of after. I, he like, keeps, it, shave, he like, a keeps month it ago. trimmed with Manscaped. I keep, I keep, that <laughs> should look like the Pirates of the Caribbean ride at Disneyland. <laughs> What? We don't know what that means. I'm trying to understand it. it don't know what that means. Right right there's, there's a bandana on it with little beads in the it. hair. It has red rum on it. Uh, and, and there's yeah. a guy. There's a oh, guy in yep, there yep. hidden, and he just won a defamation trial. You're yeah, okay. I, uh, but Lana, Lana was so, uh. so sweet to make us croissants, and uh, this is the best goddamn croissant I ever had. Yeah, yeah Lana, been Lana chefs it up. Oh, oh. God, dude. That one looked bad. Hey, you're being loud. I'm trying to talk Sorry, about my this. bad. Yeah, the crystal go on. So like, yeah, so it's flaky. It's flaky, but like not too flaky. Right. It's not like going everywhere because there's some butter in it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like up. you can tell there's love. The inside isn't just like white. It's like kind of yellow. You can tell there's some love in there. Yeah. So uh, by the way, for for Beyblades, uh, Rich Campbell was supposed to be like the co-commentator, and um, he bailed. Like he was so funny. He bailed like when Cutie announced it because I was like, because uh, <laughs> I, I I tweeted the thing out about Rich Campbell's like, hey, let's wear suits. And she messaged me, he's like, oh, he bailed. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay. So I was just like, in general. Let's just and, hang out with And she's suit. like, I'll, I'll try to find someone. And I'm like, no, I'll find someone. And I message one of the greats to ever do it. Yeah. And I message Sajam, who is a fighting game professional commentator, used to commentate uh, Capcom Pro Tour, actually got excommunicated, so the legend goes, because he criticized the game and demanded rollback netcode, yeah. which most fighting games have now rolling out, which is funny. And uh, and he like didn't get, get Capcom work anymore, and then instead became a streamer, and now is like way way more successful as a streamer. And so that's funny. I was but, wondering why like how that all came together, like why he was there. Yeah, I just asked I'm, him. I'm just learning that you were that bridge. I, I was like, yo, because because he's really funny, he's really sharp, and it was like it was great. He's a he's a professional. I will, yeah, the thing about commentary is like in melee. It's really hard to find someone who will like talk when you aren't talking. Like, dude. Oh check, yeah. My my commentary at uh, the function with hugs. It hugs loves to just sit there and not say anything after you've said three thousand sentences. He's thinking about an IPA tweet. He makes. <laughs> and Sajem is really he's a pro, he's a pro. And I was like, God, it feels so good to be with a goddamn pro. Anyway, I think we did really great. I think it was really funny. And yeah. I think the stream was really fun. He did a really good job with it. I was talking to him uh, at the beginning of the event. And we were talking about just how how weird it is that he's commentating this, that Tasteless and Artosis had done like the Amaranth event. Yeah. And he was talking about how like after all these years of doing FGC commentary, his most watched VOD on YouTube is when he commentated the Jenga tournament at HyperX. Oh, really? really? Yeah. It has like 20 million views or something. That is so I mean, sad. that's paid. Hmm? That's definitely oh, sure. paid views. 20 million views on yeah, YouTube? yeah. yeah. I don't know. Jenga's accessible. I can see Algo picking no, that up. Oh, it's a, it's, a, it's a sponsor thing, right? Oh, I'm so smart. Maybe. 
Yeah, sure. that's a, that's like just bot views. Like, uh, you remember, think they view botted it? No, no. You can like just literally pay for an ad to be shown. Like, for example, the MSI ad that we did in our house. Yeah, the 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 graphics card. The graphics card one, where I'm like, wow, what is a thirty eighty? Oh, yeah, yeah. It has like one point five million views. Yeah, it, what's it, rate it's tracing? Because, it, because it, it's it, like a sponsored yeah, video yeah, on no, YouTube. No, it's because if the YouTube ad, if the ad that goes into a pre roll or any sort of ad in the YouTube system is itself a YouTube video, that pre roll view goes toward the count. Oh. Uh-huh. Dude, speaking of fucking YouTube ads, you know who's been trying to dog me lately? Tell me His about it. His goddamn Mizkiff, that son of a bitch. What are you saying? No. I, heard he's, uh, I heard he's fallen off. I heard he's washed. Uh, wait, who, is that me in the car yesterday saying that? Yeah, because he has 25K <laughs> instead of 30K people watching him. Wait, what is he doing to you, Ludwig? Uh, well, okay. First of all, let me address the wash comment. Wait, really quick. Hold on. Mizkiff, by the way, remember when he made a joke? It was like, who the fuck wants to listen to the yard? And it was like back when we started the podcast. Uh-huh. Yeah. Guess how much fucking money we'd make on Patreon and guess how smooth I am, babe. I'm just saying. The anyway, smooth part, I don't yeah. understand adding I, in I here. I think the smooth part's the better part, to bring up, to be honest. <laughs> I'm so, so much smoother yeah, well, than you, you're Miss Gif. Miss Gif, <laughs> Miss Gif, I make one-tenth what you yeah. make. Yeah, yeah what's stick up? It, stick it to and you. I, and I split it across my friends. Yeah. <laughs> Evenly. We less than you. And our producer and our editor. Uh-huh. Uh, think, by the way, I think Miss is fine. I don't want the fucking frogs to come I also in. don't think he's... I think I, I didn't say he's washed. Clarification. He didn't. I said he, uh, he seems like he's not hype on content these days. Hey, what's up? Welcome back. We, anyway, yeah, we well, lost power. We had to restart a couple things, and we're running with no AC, so it's gonna get sweaty. We also, were saying we like, love yeah, Miss Kiff, and we think he's doing really, really well. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, and that was that was the key takeaway. You know, it's something when I well, I've had like pretty long tattoo sessions, and whenever I take like a break in the middle, it's always the worst. Oh yeah, because like your body's like, hey, you were just going through a lot of pain. Um, it's over now. It's over now. Let's start healing you. Let's start making it better. And that's kind of what you just did because you just took a bit of a break. So I'm hoping it doesn't, you know. Hurt more. Hurt more now. You know, as Alana was telling us, um, she was like, usually when people do arms, like you don't get the whole root. But she's like, when I do it, I get the whole root. She's the goat. For I was real, like, for real. yeah, you're the Michael Jordan of this shit. Dick notice this, dude. Oh, careful. <laughs> yeah, I saw uh, Lana has a uh, Funko Pop of Steve Carell and 40 year old virgin. Really? Oh, yeah, oh look, my look god. At this, dude. Oh, it's the so wax funny. version, so he has like his nipples in, in the <laughs> smiley face. <laughs> that uh, is insane. <laughs> Very cute. That's the oh god, it, it it it's like you're the only person who has a Funko Pop that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, audio people, we've worked our way to the second pit. Uh, this is the followed armpit. up by the second arm. This one's right in the camera lens too, so this will be a, a, a this will be a good one. No, now the last armpit didn't hurt very bad, and maybe because the hairs are longer. Also, the way this is done, and uh, I've seen this done at home as well. It's like you actually just pull the wax off as an entire little thing. You don't use the paper. Uh, so yeah, oh. that's what's going on here. Actually, this kind of wax doesn't hurt much because it doesn't pull the skin. Just pull the hair only. Oh. Just pulls the hair. Um, okay. It's yep. crazy that, that they were making the wax and they were like, yo, we should make one that doesn't remove skin. <laughs> that, was, that wasn't like the first <laughs> thought they had. I, it, it's just, it's a little still warm use and scary. Both. <laughs> yeah. Do you want some of your skin off for this treatment or... <laughs> Like you, know, you can pay you can pay about ten dollars more if you want to keep your Dude, skin though. Waxing, but it takes all of your skin off and you become a skeleton with muscles. Yeah, that's just called flaying, and that was a torture method. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. That's and that's 30k. So <laughs> we bring it back, we make <sighs> it beauty, and we sell it at Sephora. Yeah, in Game of Thrones, that's the uh the Bolton family. They have their banner and it's the flayed man, because they're fucking weirdos that skin people. Is that like right. spelled like filet mignon or like No, it's flay like Bobby Flay. Oh, okay. I Damn. thought I would enjoy seeing you in pain more, and I don't. Really? Yeah. Ah, you shot him with you? a paintball gun in your bedroom before. I, I know. And I, I, really, I went that. soft on him. No, I really I liked watching him. the very first one, uh-huh. but now I'm kind of like, he's just still in pain. I mean, it, yeah, and it's not ending anytime soon. How did that right? mf'er from GOT do it when he just tortured that guy Dude, for like years? Look at his armpit from GOT. I think Game of Thrones. Well, it, oh. for one, well, that was Theon Greyjoy. Yeah. And yeah. he cut off his wiener, which you would do that for me, wouldn't you? I would cut off your wiener. Yeah, for you, yeah, for, for your you personal for pleasure, you, for, like for like to 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 train me. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would do we, that. I would that make is, you. This is remarkably similar. Like here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh yeah, that, that is one hurt. that is the best oh. view I've had of this so far. Oh. And oh man, that was that was so painful he's, looking. He's kind of like Theon in the show because nobody calls him Theon, right? He's Reek, and this is slime. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh my wow. god, that wow. is it Oh All right, all right.
right, 20 bucks, Ludwig. Okay, oh, let's... No, no, no. Odds, oh odds you eat? 20, odds you take a bite? 20 bucks to give your tongue a tattoo like a fruit roll-up. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> that was... Uh, Dude, that is so gross looking. There's nothing yeah, gross that's about a, self-care, that's actually fucking Nick. disgusting. Uh, that's not true. <laughs> 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 anyway, uh, b- b- one one final thing on on Mizzy Wizzy. Wait, you never actually said your point. Yeah, at what all. is your point? I forget the original point. It was that to be you honest. said he fell off? He's washed. He's no, fell that off. Wasn't, that was that he fell point. off. You said he was I balding. Bring that he this will up. never get back to where he was. None of this is what I said. Aiden brought Power's this gonna up. Power's going to go off again in about five seconds, probably. Uh, uh, no, the one thing is that he keeps messaging me to do the ultimate match. Oh yeah, he messages me at least once a week, and he's like, "Yo, let's do ultimate." Yo, oh, let's ultimate do ultimate crew battle. Here's yeah, here's the real done. litmus I'm test down. on how badly he wants to do it. How about they fly out to L.A. for once? How about they get their shit I mean, together? He's, he's I think he's he's coming to L.A. Okay. at some in, point. In the streets, he's like, "Who wants to watch Yard?" Okay. But in the sheets, he's like, "Hey, let's play our game he, and do our." Content. He probably wants to do it on a plasma TV, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. Well, you don't play ultimate on a fucking CRT, that's for sure. No, imagine I'm, though. I will say here. Here's and you know what? I think there's a point because we're Ludwig's the only like brain rot streamer, and the rest of us are like normie podcasters. So that means we have the uh, the luxury of being able to travel without like wanting to shoot ourselves in the mouth because we're not live for a day because that's what this industry does to you. Yeah. So I understand them, it, not just Miskiff, but a whole crew flying out. I understand that not being desirable. However, I will still make fun of them. I just like that them getting on a plane is also a form of like meditation and therapy and self help in their life. Whereas for us, it's just moving from point A to point B. But for them, it's like they're they're making a big leap by leaving their room. Yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> like, I want to put them through something. I want them to grow from this experience. I don't they, I don't want to go to Texas. They traveled a good amount. They just went to Korea. Yeah, they, they, go they to did Korea, go to yeah. Korea. But they did live stream it all. So there's like this element of like it's okay to do this because we won't feel because we'll be live. We won't feel the creeping abyss. You know, the tendrils of evil creeping up on our feet that we will. You know, we're not live. And that's how I feel when I'm not podcasting. Frankly. Mm. You feel like you should. Dude, the tendrils are grabbing me. <laughs> Ludwig keeps doing this fucking thing, bro. Where he keeps doing the Michael Barbaro hmm when I'm explaining shit, and I hate it so Dude, much. Why do you hate it? Because it feels like you're not listening the same way Michael feels like he's not listening to the fucking expert yeah, but, he's but talking to. But then Michael to. will will <sighs> tell you back what you just said I can, bar for bar. I can bar. tell you bar for bar what it's you said. It's the fact that you're just looking at like hmm. a stream ugh, of Gold reacting to something, and then I'm explaining something to you, and you're like, hmm... Mm. Have you watched the mm compilation from Michael Barbaro? Yeah. yeah I love Michael Barbaro zooms. I think they're good. I'm one of the enjoyers. You like the mms. Yeah, I think he's great. Shit. <laughs> anyway, Aiden's racist. Why are you racist? We went to uh, racist? we Bud? went to What's Hot Pot. Oh, no. and, and we played a shit ton of Birio, right? We've been playing a bunch of Birio because I had this idea for an event that I think I'll do, which is like Birio Kart World Cup. Oh, that's so hype. Where uh, there's a way to play on the GameCube version of Mario Kart, Where 16 people on LAN. It has a LAN mode built into the game on a GameCube. Yeah, you can like you can like connect two cubes and then have eight people playing, but then double dash lets you have two per like two per car. Yeah. Yeah. So you can have, 16. But you can have more than two cubes. Oh, four cubes. You can have eight cubes. Wait, eight cubes? Eight cubes. <gasps> so we can have wow. that many people playing, and uh, and we can do a huge Birio uh, card thing. So we were testing this, right? So we were playing Birio. It's like me, Aiden, Nick Allen, Nick Yingling. Uh-huh. Uh, and we're going through. And the doubles in Double Dash is actually, it's high tech. Like, yeah. like the person in the back can make the drifts go faster because they're the ones who control whether you get yeah. the blue boost. And so you can get like two per turn, three per turn. Me and Josh cracked the code last night. <gasps> they were so good. They were nuts. We were I will give so it to good. Them. But we practiced and we got super drunk. And then we're like, dude, <laughs> let's go to let's go get some hot pot. Uh huh. So we go to this hot pot. Place. And Aiden's like, no, I don't like I don't like that kind of food. Uh huh. Well, more, worse. Aiden ah! shows up. Aiden said, do you got you guys have chicken tenders or like <laughs> something I, I can dip no, in ketchup? I, these are all things I wish he did. He goes and then he starts speaking Chinese or Mandarin, really? I should say. You know, because he studied Mandarin, so he's just like, like I think one person said "shushu" at the table next to us, and it set him off. <laughs> Lana likes that one. <laughs> "Shushu," Ludwig. Yeah, yeah, nice pronunciation, <laughs> loser. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Did you made fun of him last time for not speaking enough Chinese, or, or Nick did? Because he studied Chinese. Yeah, yeah. Where's the right amount of Chinese to say? Uh, apparently, not, there's no winning with no, you two. No, okay. Because it wasn't a normal amount because you weren't just speaking it out of the table. You weren't just speaking it when like the waiters were around. You were texting Zipper 3's friends in Chinese. What? What do you, why? 
Because he's drunk, and when he's <laughs> drunk, he just like starts speaking Mandarin now. It's like a new thing. He That's does. actually kind of hype. I was actually just saying, so I was sitting at the table, and I was like, I, you know what's funny is I was remembering more than I had in a long time just by like working through sentences and stuff. And so gets I drunk would, and turns I would, Chinese. I would have remembered like words, and then I would make, I would just say a new sentence that only <sighs> I would understand at the table, and then I would laugh to myself. I did like the Atrioc laugh every time <sighs> I said a sentence. That you know what's funny when uh, Aiden start started learning. Chinese and he, like we had this this idea that like he would oh this one's gonna hurt really quick really quick this Let's one looks just, tough oh. Oh, I want to keep that one and I want to use it as a bookmarker <laughs> yeah this, this will go in your goosebumps <laughs> uh, oh. dude I had this old bookmark that was just a it was a cutout of a Wii remote <laughs> I'm like imagining having like my Wii remote bookmark and then my one that's uh, solidified such... wax hair you, dude, knew, you, you, you were the apple kid of of uh we of Nintendo products. There was this idea that Eamon would be like a salty old like uh, like guy, ah, like playing Go with all the the yeah. old dudes in the in the parlor smoking cigarettes. Dude, that was my dream because yeah. when I, when I started studying, it was like in the thick of COVID, so you you really could not go out and do anything. Like everything was closed, and I was getting to go into Go at the time, and I was like, the perfect place to learn Chinese would be at old Go clubs in SoCal, but all of them were out of commission. Like during that time period, so I could never go. But we had this vision of me hanging out with like Chinese old men playing yeah, go, smoking and cigarettes with like dark glasses and just screaming, <laughs> talking, the table. talking shop about how the CCP would fix this place up. <laughs> Aiden getting tilted at a game, but doing it in Chinese this time. Yeah, but yeah. everything else is the same. That that's brilliant. That's a performance art in my head. So wait, what? Yeah. I, how how did Mario Kart go? Do you think it's got legs? Oh, oh it's it, got, it's so, it has so it has so many legs. It, might, it has more than two. That's great. It's a goaded idea, and I think we will do it. And yeah. We'll drink. Well, now we have to do it know, fast. There was a there was a a moment last night because uh, after the Beyblade event, uh, Point Crow and Abby came over, and we were running it back again. And Point Crow was driving, and Abby was in the back seat. And what you can do in the co op mode is you can punch to your right and left, yeah. and that moves your momentum. You can't do that when you're a single player. Like, that isn't an option oh, on the controller. Oh, interesting. And, and, and computers do it to you all the time. Yeah. It's yeah. so and annoying. The punches, the punches move your vehicle's momentum in a weird way that, like, drifting okay. does not normally. And there was this one point where Point Crow takes this really tight line where he looks like he's about to hit the wall, and then Abby punches. Yeah. So they move out of the way of the wall and they get like a god line around this wow. corner. And I'm like, this is this is the next level of the game. <laughs> and I, I'm super, super excited for it now. That's hype. Um, uh, do you know the tier list for Double Dash? No. Wait, no what do you mean? I don't. Like, like who's the best character? Shit like that. I think uh, the, I think the, the, I think the, the best vehicle, car is the train car. Yeah, the train car is the best cart for sure. And I think the, I don't know the second best, well, not counting the gold car. Yeah. I think it has busted stats. Probably should ban it. Uh, unless uh, everyone next. uses it. But boring. Uh, and then the second best car, I think, is the baby stroller or something. Maybe that's also one's pretty good. The ta- all the time trial world records are the are the train. Really? Yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. I play like I'm a child, so I still go baby Ouija and then like Yoshi because I B-B-G. like Yoshi. <laughs> baby Ouija. Baby Ouija. Yeah. Oh my god! You know, in in Yoshi's story, okay, she's gonna start on the legs now, by the way, <gasps> which are extremely hairy. Right. <laughs> They're hairiest part of my body. Um. The. Yeah, yeah. yeah this <laughs> You're is ready gonna to be, scream. This is gonna be rough. <laughs> I'm on a Kiss concert. There's so much more hair on your legs than there were. I actually think the legs aren't as bad. We'll see. Having done okay, no, I did this once. I, I did this. Uh, I, I waxed a piece of my leg, and it, it hurt pretty bad. So, really? Yeah. So. Well, okay. Before the she starts, then please tell us about the Stavros call. Uh, no Stavros. So it was funny. He messaged me on Twitter, and he's like, "Yo, slime, you sexy, sexy bastard." And, and he was like, "I was wondering if I could ask you some questions about YouTube," and I'm like. Yeah, sure. And I was thinking, like, I'm not quite the guy, but I, I might, I probably will know more than him, you know. But like, who knows? Just by being in proximity, and uh, and so I, I, I was like, yeah, I'll be free in a bit, and, and he gives me his number, and I call him up, and he's basically just asking for his advice on um, rolling out his special that he put out yesterday. And he's like, so like, how do you think? What's like the best way to do this and this and that? And I'm like, well, you probably want to live stream it, and then those viewers go into the views of the video because you can set them up like the video premieres after the live stream ends. And shit. He's like, okay, yeah, that's what I was gonna do. That's what I was gonna do. He's, he basically knew what to do already, but he called me and ah, oh, that's my calf. And he <laughs> and he uh, and he made me feel really special and and uh, and wanted when he did that. Oh. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh. that's really- I'm just so excited when I think about our friendship. Right. Yeah, and it makes yeah. me feel good and happy about it. Uh, Don't scream if you love him, though. That- oh. Oh. Wow. 
That's hurtful for oh, him. Oh, you are bright red. God damn it. That's hurtful. Oh, for him. you're so. Can you so, show? Can you show this one? So much oh. hair, dude. Holy shit. There's a lot of hair. So Hassan, this makes sense because he's on Hassan's stream right now while Cutie and Maya are there. Yeah, he's doing a little um, tour, just promo. And uh, there's like, you know, there's like 50k people watching Hassan at the moment. Now, Hassan was spamming the chat with the link to the special. I watched it on the way over here too, so congrats to him. His YouTube channel has been popping off too. Like he's done a really good job with it. Uh, uh, yeah, you know what's funny? I asked him, he's like, yeah, I'm putting it on my YouTube. And I'm like, okay, how much, how many subs do you have on your YouTube? And he's like... Oh, like 238, and I start grimacing, and he's like, 1,000. I'm like, dude, like, yeah. you're doing great. You're better yeah. than us. Yeah. He pumps it. He posts, a, he posts a short, like a short of like one bit basically every day. Yeah, that's and great. I, I watch every single one. Dude, I, I, well, okay, what's really funny, I was listening to the, a recent episode of Come Town, and uh, they were talking about, Stop was like pushing his special, and he was like, yeah, and I talked to the algo gods. I, I, I reached out to some algo gods I know. He said that, and I was like, in my head, I'm like, I wonder who he talked to. Because like, cause, like he, when, I, when I went to, me and Abe went to his birthday, and he was like, I want to talk to you about Patreon. And I was yeah. like, that's crazy. Yeah, it is crazy. Yeah, because, yeah. Because, he looked at you guys. He's, yeah, like, he's yeah. like, I'm going to hit you because guys up when about we Patreon were making up, When we were making the yard, we were like, if we can get a fraction of what Cumtown has, we'll be happy. We literally said that. Yeah, and, and he came up, and he's like, I, I want to learn some things. And I was like, that's crazy. But I was like, I wonder ah! who. Oh, my Bro. God, Anthony. Okay, so. Uh, so I was. I, mean, I wonder who he talked to. I wonder who the algo gods are in, in Stav's eyes, and it's uh, it's it's Anthony. Yeah, Me, I'm the algo is... god. Nice to meet you. Funny that <laughs> Anthony's the algo god. Me, bro. You're okay. <laughs> you're you're not doing anything wrong. You're doing everything right. This is your job, and you're a professional. You're an expert. And you're very nice. Ah, oh, uh, and um, <laughs> fuck, this one's gonna hurt. Ah. Oh! There's not like extra secrets that I would have though. I think that I could tell them. Oh my Jesus Christ! Can you hold it? Can you hold it like kind of over here, like next to like where his face is? Dude, <laughs> it looks like. What's up, gang? Yo, it hey, looks fuck like you. a. It looks like what the top of your head would be like if you grew it out. So yeah, someone. <laughs> says, someone That's the funniest thing you've ever said. Someone update the yard flag. <laughs> Oh, oh, that one oh, stuck. It didn't oh, play. My God. oh no! God damn it! <laughs> yeah, no postcards this year for the uh, oh, the fuck shit. you two. You're just gonna get hair. Yeah, we're gonna send out these. Every, every <laughs> fuck you will get uh, a piece of uh, a piece of wax paper. Oh, one man. wax paper with some hair on it. I'm thinking about rolling it up. <laughs> like, hey, yes, dude. <laughs> someone smokes my wax. <laughs> dude, RPS loser licks. Oh, wow. That is so gross. That's the I'm thing fine. is, I'll do it. You'll do it. And I'm never scared. A, a, a tongue poke or a lick? Uh, just a full on like. No ah. way! No way! Like it's a cartoon character licking a lollipop, <laughs> and they get it all in one go. <laughs> That's so fucking Undolled. gross. When we were uh, what? Yeah, all of it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All of it. We got to do we're, it. Yeah, we're very as much as you need. So we're very is, close. This by is the, the way. area. This is the area that I soft tested for Anthony, and uh, it. It did hurt pretty bad. <laughs> you wait. What do you mean soft? Like, like you did it to yourself? I tried waxing, like at home wax on right. on my thigh. Yeah. Um. I ax I at home waxed my leg and it, it didn't feel great. But I love how smooth it is. You out. have less, dude. You have pretty much hairless legs. I feel like. No, my calves have in hair. comparison, dude. Can you yeah. show them. I mean, compared to this Little guy, bear. can you hold? Can you pull dude, it up? You have like no leg hair. This is this is what. Never I got. mind. I'm, I'm wrong. I mean, it's uh. not it's not like a shit ton compared to this guy. This guy's like a Greek god. The hair department, south of the head. <laughs> yeah, it is my legs. I'm looking at like Austin Powers or Steve Carell, where you know it's like I got shit on my chest. Like some people have a lot of hair on their back. I have hairless back. You're one of those statues of like like the sculptures of Greek people when the head is already fallen off from like being in a war. That's the <laughs> amount of you that is a Greek god of hair. Oh God, you know what's funny? I I get this. Oh! Get this what, man? I I get this money. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dude, this looks so fucking painful. You're a soldier. It's, it's, it's pretty it's bad. It's really hard. I'm not, I'm not, guys, I'm not playing it up or anything like that. It just really... Is this the worst part so far? Yes. 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 Dude, maybe we'll take the combo away look, from you. Look, look, look. His armpit, it looks like a shaved pussy. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, close your arm, close your arm. Close your arm again. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it fucking does. That's crazy. No, 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 would no, fuck no, your no, arm no, and then god. never talk to you again. Uh, bro. Oh god, dude. <laughs> I, 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 and, I, then, and then leak your social security number. This is for later, bro. Yeah, we were making a joke that if Aiden breaks up with you, he'll fucking post your social security number on Twitter. Not, I just wanted to like make sure we that. create distance between ourselves. This is crazy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that is crazy. Dude, it's got a little labia in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting this in the Patreon. <laughs> that is crazy looking, dude. I I get is, that done. Um, 
the the, the, the when she did my calf the the last last lower leg I actually the pain was so so hardcore Call me the aloe vera to calm oh, me down. Aloe vera. She also okay. asked me if I wanted numbing spray, and you said I, no. like a fool, said no. Yeah, that's no, pretty hard. Is that a thing? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just why did you do that? Would you do that? Yeah. No, you wouldn't. Are, are, are you For saying, the content. Like, would you do... If you did this on fucking stream, you wouldn't do oh, the numbing spray. Yeah, no, yeah, I wouldn't. If, if it's no. like I'm gonna do get surgery on the yard, but then you go under for it, like, <laughs> okay, <laughs> or you do you. local anesthetic. Yeah, it. so stupid. So she's putting aloe vera on the already waxed. How does that feel? Uh, it doesn't change anything. It might feel better. Is it cool? I feel, might have to wait a few minutes. Yeah. But this is, yeah, this is, this does not, I want the viewers to know this does not prevent the pain from the waxing process. Someone just opened the cactus and was like, let's rub this on it. I don't think anyone's <laughs> worried about you feeling pain. I think everyone knows. You but, pain. What I was saying is that, uh, so I, I have to get like uh, physical therapy and also like massages every now and then to like heal my broken old body. And what I found out is that I have the first the first time I went to physical therapy and she's like massaging my neck and like she has to get under there. She's like, you know what? This is so much easier on bald people. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, cool. <laughs> like, Thanks. I think that it, I, it did make me feel nice though because it's like, oh, this allows her to do her job better. Right. And uh, in addition, <laughs> when I get massages, I am told that I have very nice skin. Like on your head skin? No, or like just on my, like my back and my upper body and stuff. I do think Anthony has. I think Anthony has nice skin and nice teeth. Very clear. Yeah. I don't know. My gums are going away. I don't know why. I think I'm gritting them too much. You're gritting your teeth? Problems. Yeah. I, I learned that I grind my teeth at night recently at the dentist. They said you, they said you cool grind word. your teeth. And I said, I grind every hour of the day. Yeah, it's shoddy. Like, tell me something I don't know, you yeah. dumbass so dentist Don't say that ass. to me. Oh. I haven't gone to the dentist in five years. Yeah, I think we already talked oh, about this. But did like, you tell this on the podcast? No, I don't think so. We talked about it outside. Oh, no, I think it, I brought it up. But tell what, the people how weird you are. I haven't gone to the dentist in five years or to the doctor for any like physical checkup. Dude, oh. I'm, I'm almost in the same boat. Because as you. weed is my medicine and money is my cure. Amen. Yeah, he, he uses hemp toothpaste, so it's all good. <laughs> well, I am preparing. I've been flossing just to prepare because I've never gone to the dentist. <laughs> the and they were flossing, like, flossing to reverse the cavities I already have. <laughs> I've been doing the orange justice to promote hair growth. I've been uh, flossing for my teeth. Well, do you remember when you were a kid and then you're supposed to go to the dentist and you floss like the day and a half beforehand? Yeah. And then you go in and they immediately know. Yeah, they're, they're like, like, you are inflamed. Yeah. <laughs> and they're like, hey, uh, you should be flossing a little more regularly. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, I think I said this before, the last time I went to the dentist, I had been flossing because I got my gums uh, planed, which is a fucked up. I would not advise that. It hurts. Plane like and how you plane wood? It's called planing and scraping, and they take this like weird little to your hot, gums. Yeah, they hot little laser, and they like laser the inside of your gums, and you look like you were like smoking meth for your whole life. <laughs> They're all bloody and weird. But oh, it's, it's I will good never ever do that. Wait, what's the appeal? Like, uh, it cleans it. It's like an extreme deep clean. You do it like every once in a while. I feel like that's like cleaning your skin every by once cutting it off. I'm just going to Hooters that week and ruining them again. Why would I do it? Yeah, I don't know, man. I am really scared about this wax strip. This is my upper thigh, and it's really hairy, and ouchy bears is happening. Your soon, arms look man. great. I actually am considering doing my this My chest now. also looks good, too. Your smooth yeah. body looks, looks great. Dude, your muscles look more defined. Like, and, I, oh, and I haven't even been working out because I've been laid up. This is you not even at max potential. No, this, is, this all checks out. This is like when you do it on your, uh, when you do it on your dick, and you're... Dick looks bigger. Yeah, your dick looks bigger. Dude, speaking of uh, beautiful bodies, I me, I went to ah. I went to a new climbing gym, the one that you and uh, I did a thing went uh -huh. to. That place is crazy. It's yeah. huge. Uh, Cliffs of Eden in Los Angeles. Um, and uh, I haven't been to ah. a gym in general in a very long time where there's just like naked people in the bathroom. Oh yeah, you saw some dumb. Uh -huh. And so, but I I've been to a bunch of climbing gyms, and none of them are also showers for the ones I've been to. Yeah. So I was like. You know, I'm just going to go wash my hands like I always do. And I walk in, and I, and I look left, and I'm like, wow, this is a nice bathroom. They have a blow dryer in here. They have, like, lotion. They have, like, everything you could need in this bathroom. And then I look right, and I felt like I was in Ram Ranch. I saw I saw a slew. Because, like, you know, at the, at, the, at the regular oh, gym. 16, 17. <laughs> at, the, at the regular gym, there's, like, this slew of, like, there's old people. There's, like, you know, there's a bunch of different types of people. people who I feel, to, well, yeah, when I go to the gym, when I used to go to the gym, because uh, I, when I personal train, it's, like, a smaller gym. But, like, you go to, like, your, your box gym, and then you, you go into, it's usually old cock. Yeah. Is what you say. Yeah. If you're at the rec center, you got, you got some 65-year-old who's just done 
finished his fucking 20 yeah. laps. And they don't have shit to care about or think about. So well, you just see it all. Well, I got in a Salvador Dali painting and <laughs> I, I, I look around and uh, I realize I'm at a climbing gym where everybody is hotter than you. Everybody oh, yeah. is a beast. Everybody with, looks like Alex. And they're ripped. And, and uh, I turn around and I just see a slew of naked guys all walking around me behind like, I just didn't notice yeah. are they like young like, hot I see 30 year old guys they're, they're like yeah they're all just shredded yeah, and ripped and Chad, I was just like Chad and Brad and Big Meat Brian and, Anders yeah Big Meat my Anders, Anders D- damn Brian I, your cock's looking bigger uh, than ever yeah, oh. I, I think uh, oh. oh that one wasn't clean okay you're okay you're doing great it's about the pilot, not the oh, plane. Oh, that one did not. That one seemed like when you take old Velcro off. Uh-huh. The pilot, not the plane. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> but uh, we said right. that so much. Yeah, in the I Beyblade think tournament. I think I may have had <laughs> my uh, my second sexual awakening. I think me and you. Are, I think we're, I'm bisexual now, Aiden. Hey, yo, congrats. Yeah, me and you. So, uh. so does that change? Are, is our friendship different now? Do we have to like kiss, get romantic? No, no. Uh, honestly, fuck. honestly, you you have a long way to go before you get to the level of sexual chemistry that's been developing between me and Ludwig lately. Wait, where, oh. where anytime we're hanging out, you'll point at an <laughs> object that even remotely looks like you can sit on it, and you'll say, I'm going to fuck you on that. Which has been you... Which has been the new bit for the past two weeks. I say it threateningly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It it never sounds like a fun time. We're at, dude, we're at the gym yesterday, and there's like this. It it looks like one of those uh, one of those like sit down squat machines, but it looks a little. It looks like a fucking torture device to stretch. Yeah, it looked, but it looked weird. Machine. It looked weird and yeah. different. I I don't know how to describe why why it seemed there odd. There cables and pulleys and straps. Yeah, and leather. And he just comes up to me. He like comes up behind me. We haven't been talking before this, by the way. And he's like, "I'm gonna fuck you, silly, on that." And I'm like, and then and then there's like this 10 second pause, and he's like, "Don't tell Nick Allen I said that." <laughs> <laughs> well, it's because Nick Allen told me I didn't know this in California. If you have a company with more than five employees, you have to do sexual harassment training. Oh yeah, yeah. Do that. which yeah, so- is which is good, and I'm on board. <laughs> yeah, for it. yeah. But in light of that, I've been sexually harassing Aiden <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> on a near daily basis. Yeah, to warm up to that's Cause training because you, yeah. you don't you don't have to stop doing the sexual harassment until you take well, the exam. Yeah, I haven't done the training. That's yet. also in in the California law. I'm going to show California how <laughs> well the training worked by harassing you so much before. We'll get a great before yeah, and after yeah. pick. Yeah. And after, I'm not going to ah! harass you at all. Your company There's also like, it also needs a breastfeeding room. There, so we yeah, we that. need a breastfeeding Do room. We? Yeah, ah. we'll get a nice before pick where you're standing next to me with your hand on my crotch, and then we'll get an after pick where we're ah. five feet apart and, and you're both thumbs up. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you've got two thumbs. It doesn't harass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the best. See, and then <laughs> who's got two you, thumbs you and text, neither of them are on you? You text Susie. You're like, I just got through a big exam. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys do this one at YouTube, but uh, it's really helped me personally. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Susan, few tips to go to CEO. Don't tell your employees you want to fuck them. <laughs> we make, I'm not an assaulter anymore t-shirts. <laughs> Dude, Lester sends you another text like a week later. He's like, hey, thanks for sending her that text. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's been tough. Behind Dude, the doors. How many, how many companies do you think, like there's companies that launder money and then there's companies that just forge like sexual training documents. Like you know what I mean? Oh yeah, for oh, sure. Yeah, yeah we can. We all. Like, hey, we're all chill. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we did it. I promise, dude. I remember because we took we we had to take that exam or like the training while we were at Summit, and I remember reading the questions and answering oh, them. Oh, dude, you sent one of these. So this be this is after I quit. <laughs> After I hadn't been there. Yeah. And I was like, that's fucking hilarious. Dude, the questions on the exam are so funny. Well, what's one of the <laughs> I, 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 there are, there are so many scenarios where it's like, is it, is it okay to tell, like, to walk up to your coworker and tell them they have, like, nice breasts? And then it's like, yes or no. <laughs> it's like, and, and it's like, what? Who? I just well, like, I took the whole test on. and I was like, who's this, struggling with this exam? There, there's like, something. I mean, is she wearing a, uh, a t-shirt that says, ask me about my breasts? That's a good <laughs> that's point. That's a good point. That's a good point. Does she have that and t-shirt then, on? And then there's a follow-up question that's ah! like, well, is it okay now? <laughs> and then it <laughs> yeah. shows the same one and they're like four times bigger. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually yeah. 12 questions and it's the same question, but her breasts just Well, get, it's like, I'm just, at that oh, point, God. I'm just impressed. At that point, it's a compliment, right? Yeah. I, you know what's funny is uh, I literally forgot what I was going to say because it hurts so fucking much. That is uh, funny. The exam uh. the exam also has really, really funny sketches that go along with some of the questions too. Can like I ask they you make like a, a hypothetical that might be on it? Yeah, sure. Okay, like let's say 
is it okay if I were to say uh, to you, I'm going to fuck you silly on that table? Yeah. Is that, yeah, is that that's, not fly on things? Is that a no usually? That's that's rough. It needs it's more context. Rough. needs more God. context. Do you have a shirt that says fuck me silly on this table? <laughs> yeah, yeah, on this table. Yeah. Yeah. The one behind me in the wax. Hey, Ludwig yeah, yeah. Algren, <laughs> fuck me silly on this table. And then on the back of the shirt, it says, no, really, please ask me the question. <laughs> and under it says, here is my signature for real. This is like a legally binding contract. <laughs> that's, the, that's the Austin Powers bit. <laughs> is it okay to ask then, Ludwig? Is it okay? And you're not wearing pants. You're butt naked. <laughs> That's the Austin Hello. Powers. He's like, yeah, Swedish penis enlargement. That's not my bag, baby. Like, Here's your book titled Swedish penis enlargements and other things are my bag, baby. Are my bag, baby. <laughs> yeah. Written by Austin Powers. Dude, that movie's so fucking good. Dude, I found good. out that Mike Myers is American. Or oh, Canadian. He's Canadian, Canadian, bro. Canadian. But he has like How a normal accent. How dare you steal that? Yeah. I, I didn't you realize. You thought he was British. Look. Yes. That's crazy. I thought he was British because Austin Powers and Shrek. Oh, if, we a- can't, if we can't fit every country in the Great World War, Canada would just be part of America. Yeah, true. Like, like if everyone had to participate, but not everyone could have representation. Canada's joining America. Did you watch like the same uh, GQ yes. interview or whatever? Yeah. yeah. And he was like, and he was like, yeah, He's I was a- just doing my Shrek role, and then I was like, maybe we should do an Irish accent. And uh, I was like, what? Are, how are you talking like it's this? Scottish, by the way. He's a nice little Greg spiel Scottish. about the differences between Canadian and American culture, and that that I really Don't like. Get- you guys just reminded me, dude. Something that like a power you lose when you hang out with non normies is that you can't just like. <sighs> Quote like a random Veritasium video, like a, a thing you know about the world, because all the nerds have already seen it, and they're like, "Yeah, oh. I, yeah, I watch Veritasium, dude. It's a big YouTube channel." <laughs> but I go, I go to Thanksgiving with with the girlfriend's family, and I'm saying, so I'm saying, oh. you guys know what would happen if, dude, this looks like meat. <laughs> I'm sorry, I no, didn't mean it, to interrupt no, you. I'm, I'm in awe. I'm like, actually this, not, this literally looks like you get it at the store. Yeah, yeah that's what I was gonna say. This is what hangs upside down in the in the rack. This, oh. this looks like a, like a diagram in a science class of what the leg looks like. Uh, oh, yeah, go on. It, no, that's pretty Dude, much it. No, no. His pubes are hanging out. Look at the pubes hanging out. What was the quote? Oh, is it? I thought it was I was I, mean, I thought it was Gooch well, where hair hanging out. Start and where end. Did, yeah. yeah, where does Gooch start and the leg begin? This is the intro to the intro to a Vsauce video. <laughs> Do you know where do pubes end? I, I said Aiden uh, his video. It, it was like a forty-minute video about how the Ukrainian uh, Russia conflict is about natural resources, Dude. and I was like, "Banger!" And it's 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 so dry. This is what me and Aiden do. Yeah. It's just like it's like, hey, check out this extremely informative and dry video about a world conflict. Dude, you know, okay. So here's my new favorite type of YouTube drama. It's when these channels get into battles where, where there's yeah. like a conflict in facts and they make like a reply video. Economics explained, yeah, getting, and, getting so diced up. Somebody, uh, somebody made a reply video to a different video that Real Life Lore had made ah. about the uh, about the California high speed, speed rail network. And I'm watching this video and at the beginning he's like, He's like calling them discount Wendover Productions and shit. Whoa, and, no. and, and I'm like, I, ah. this is like educational channels going to bat, like yep. train wreck unfollowing Ludwig. <laughs> <laughs> it's the small ant point crow of nerd. Yeah. yeah. Dude, it's, it's like when you. Except they all have ah. way bigger followings. Because all these videos get like 5 million views, yeah, right? Yeah. But they're not like the person or character <laughs> in ah. the video. It's yeah, like they're, when they're, all the cool kids watch the nerds rap battle in, at the lunch line. Ah. And everyone crowds around and thinks to type. God, I hated rap battles. Growing up in Colorado, in Mountain Colorado, everyone's a DJ and they're a rap battler and they're so fucking lame because you can tell what they already been cooking up for like four years in high school and they bust it out and their one friend is like, oh! Yo, I got a gun so big though. <sighs> I wish I, I wish they were funny. I do have <laughs> disdain for a college porch freestyle. Dude, we let's just introduce uh, Aiden to Asher Roth Yeah, today. we just showed Aiden Asher Roth. Yeah, and that's that was, really uh, funny. Don't because, pass out with your shoes on, by the dude, way. Dude, a friend, a friend of ours who I, I literally can't name because I'm bound by an agreement. So if you don't know who that is or the songs he's made, it, listening to the one song was kind that, of like putting my party. head through. I was talking to Dawson. Last night was, I was ta- awfully crazy. I was talking to Dawson. And we were talking about Sage Jam because he we think he's great. And I was telling him, like, oh, Sage Jam's got bad knees. Remember that for the future if we got to run <laughs> up on him. It's just true. Oh, yeah. He, Sage, Sage Jam, Sage Jam to told us why he had bad knees at the event. <laughs> he used to be a wrestler yeah. and he used to coach wrestling. And he looks like Mr. Beast uh, in person, which is really funny. And uh, what? so no he kind of does. He, does. he kind of does. He does. Yeah, he kind of does. He, and, and he's right. I don't know. I think you're Catholic. I guess I only know his oh. profile picture. Oh! That, that was the biggest grunt yet, I think. It really hurts on the legs. And, That's uh, what I thought would happen. So I was saying that uh, we were t- Dawson, me and him do- talking, and Tasty Steve ugh, is like the co-commentator for Sage Jam a lot. They do a lot of events together, and they're like a duo. 
And uh, we have a friend who really doesn't like uh, Tasty Steve's commentary right there. And uh, and we, it's always so funny because he's like, he's fine. Like, Tasty yeah. Steve is like, at the worst, like, like just kind of mild. But at the best, he's like really, really great. And uh, there's no reason for this friend to hate him. Uh, or hate his commentary. I think he thinks he's fine. And uh, and we were like, dude, Dawson was like, dude, you can't listen to this guy who was our friend. He's like, he likes Asher Roth. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, no fucking no. way. And I've known this guy for years. And we play video games all the time. He's be so mad about and this. I'm like, and I was like, that is insane. And then Dawson messages him. He's like, hey, asking in no particular reason at all, do you like Asher Roth? Like, you talked about, you know, you were into him. And he's like, yeah. And he screenshots and sends me the conversation. I'm like, I can't handle this right now. I literally, I feel like I'm being betrayed by a friend. Oh, well, Lana's me? my friend, though. She would never betray me. But <laughs> I don't get why you're mad. And he I, just but, likes college. But, what I, <laughs> and, but no, I. and then I'm immediately going in our Discord with our friends. I'm immediately about to at this person and be like, I, I thought I knew you, bro. And I'm just like, it's so fucking lame. And Dawson is immediately like, wait a minute. The conversation with him has just turned earnest. You are not allowed to roast him for three weeks. Yeah, there's, said, a, there's, a, there's a cool down. You can't just said, hit back so to back. So then he just brought it up on the yeah, podcast. Yeah, but I didn't say who, so it could be anybody. Everyone who's in the Discord you were going to roast him in knows. It could be anybody. It could be anyone at and, all. And that person would out themselves if they admitted it. And maybe they should come forward. So I'll see you in three <laughs> weeks. Anyway, Asher Roth... That it's insane that that song exists. I fucking hate that guy. Uh, man, I love homework. <laughs> hey. What are you thinking about what the kids' bot version of college would be? I love math class. Yo, I was just at this, and I had the teacher completely naked. I don't know. That's, that's <laughs> school shooting drill last night was awfully crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, a, yeah. You know, look, a hey, miscellaneous fucking TikTokers. They. Loving's not a part of it. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. Yo, yeah. They bust out that one. Yo, shouts out. Wait, he, that's uh, a real thing that people deal with, and I like bringing up social commentary. Yeah, yeah you're, no, you're, 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 you're just your evil little friends that 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 held that held poor small Bean Ludwig captive. <laughs> and that you we know you won't you don't make the jokes, but we kind of go We yeah. scripted right. that joke and made him say that. I'm <laughs> a hero. You guys are right. Everything you're saying is correct. Anyway, ah, uh, shouts dude, out he, to all content creators. You know what? Actually, I am a bad influence. I found out. Oh yeah. Even though I have not been paid to gamble. The gamble story from the gamble guy ah, in Vegas. That was so, dude. Everyone wanted to know about that. Everyone wanted to know about it, and it was it was hot news. And oh. uh, and I got I got word from one guy in particular who's in Vegas, uh, and he ran into gamble guy, Whoa. and through like like hanging out at like uh like some party, the guy was like, "Want to hear my SpongeBob?" Eh. He oh, figured like, out. Oh, no. He figured out because he's a yard watcher. He was like, "Wait, are you?" No way. And the guy was like, yeah, I am. And so this guy and his fucking five friends who are in Vegas for like, you know, whatever reason guys go to Vegas, scrounged together a thousand bucks amongst all of them. Like uh -huh. all the money they had brought to that's gamble. Like, that's like me and Miles at Evo. Baby. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly <laughs> like that's, that. That's, that's just us three years ago. Yeah. <laughs> and they give it to the guy. Uh huh. They give him all his money. And, and he's telling me this story because he tells me on stream and I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, dude, this is, this is bad. This is bad yeah. that you are giving well, a great Well, if you're in Vegas already, it's not like you're not gambling. Hold on, did they win? Well, well, boy, Nick, do I have a little tale for you. He goes to blackjack with the money. This is oh. one gold chip, by the way, or ten blacks. Which is like, okay, you know, I, I, I was... That's like paying someone to wash your car, and they uh, take it to a drive through car wash. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, no, I could have done that. Yeah. Uh, but... He spins that shit up to six racks. What? No, dude, way, I have dude. never turned a grand to six in my life. He had it at 13K at one point. That is crazy. And then they right. went down. That's uh, right. And he was telling me, and I'm scared to say this now because then people I feel like are going to go on they're this. Gonna be, out they're going to be asking yeah. around, hey, do, hey, do SpongeBob dude, real quick. Do SpongeBob. <laughs> they're just going to be they're running asking everyone. Yeah. <laughs> It's not the guy. It's yeah. not the guy. They have the audio from the yard, the SpongeBob. They're like, doesn't matter. <laughs> He's up. like, hey, what uh, what would you say is like a place you would work like if you lived under <laughs> the sea? I like the idea of there's a bunch of different different guys like this in Vegas, and they all have a different cartoon character call. Dude, sign. I bet the Patrick guy is so good at like betting on horses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, and and anyway, don't <gasps> go on your pilgrimage to Vegas to go give your money to I, Gamble Guy. I'm going to Vegas uh, in like a few weeks. Are you? Yeah. 
or whenever I can't remember the date. Uh, I, think it's, I think it's the weekend coming up. Actually, uh, I'm waiting for someone to lose all their money. So I will link you with Gamble Guy because he has to lose. Eventually, oh, it's be Nick, because Nick has always historically caught the the tail, the ass end of our gambling. Oh, I'm, adventures. I'm on the up and up though. I, yeah, in Arizona, I, I was clean. Yeah, bro. It's Aiden become, was me. It's become Aiden's me. the new me because he wasn't around for the times. Become me. So Aiden's the new me. I just, I just want to quote. I, I, I realized how much I miss Miles because I messaged him because uh, there was a Doug Polk tweet about like because WSOP is going on right now, so it's like 30 days of like a shitload of poker events, cash game or like tournament stuff and all this stuff, and then that's the main event that happens in July, uh, which is like a 10k buy-in. It's like thousands of people play, and Doug Polk made this tweet where he was like. You know, it's kind of like, I miss the old days, like, no one was buying a PC or action, no one was, like, doing vlogs. They just, like, went to Vegas to take a shot at the good life and see what happened, you know? Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, that kind of feels, that reminds me of Melee, you know, like Genesis. Like, you just taking a trip with the boys and maybe you, you really got what it takes. I sent that to Miles and he was like, he just instantly says, yeah, you know, you just show up and you win eight, eight coin flips in a row and become the chosen undead. And I'm like, <laughs> he just said that immediately. Like, his, his ability to just, like, ugh. Just say the funniest thing contemporary is, man, I, I feel like I'm always behind. And this is a bit of introspection right now, that's all. I'm not trying to be funny. No, look, you're, you're so far into this pain right now that you're allowed to be introspective. Every time I, I hung out with Miles and like when I lived with him, I was like, this guy's just ahead of me on being quick. And I never felt like I caught up, ever. Oh, I man. love that. Love that Just do an Australian word. pilgrimage. I love that C word. Also, we are. Alex is not that big compared to me. The camera angle made him seriously look like a Dark okay. Souls character. Yeah. He is. Yeah. He is. Wait, no, 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 no. I literally look you. like a tiny little guy. You yeah. are. Was yeah. It? You are. I'm going to fucking go to him in Oz and I'm going to stand next to him and be like, take this fucking picture right now. He's way fucking bigger than he you. He is considerably but he's not taller as big than you. As Dude, he appeared you know in the people, people are going to take, take that photo. They're going to Photoshop him slightly larger <sighs> than you. Just slightly more large. And then that's going to be the one that everyone sees. Yeah. I did like that. It, it's like the fucking ninja. You ever see that picture of ninja where he accidentally goes live and he looks depressed and his eyes are red? And he's <laughs> like, yes. the camera? Ben Stiller. Yes. Or, no, no, no. What's his name? The guy in the mummy. Uh, Brandon, oh, Fraser. Brandon Fraser. The Brandon Fraser it's pick. It's hyper edited. Yeah. It's hyper edited. Like the actual video of him, he just looks like kind of tired. Yeah, you know, it doesn't look great. But then they everybody like knows. Shit. Everybody yeah. knows that picture, and it's just fake. Yeah, this is like when uh when Hugs's wiki, his photo was just his forehead was slightly larger, and his eyes were slightly bigger. Yeah, they were slightly <laughs> far apart. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. It, 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 like it's just Taylor Joy, who is beautiful. You by can't one hundred percent tell if it's photoshopped, but you uh -huh. can, it just feels off. Uh, what he did, he got for one of the summits was, um, they, they kept photoshopping on, on the summit couch, smaller and smaller. Yeah. Yes. But, like compared to our modder. So, yeah. so whoever was next to him and he, yeah, he looked like a little toy. <laughs> Dude, I saw, I saw hugs at summit. I walked up and I was like, uh, I, you know, how hugs is on his shit right now where he just like, he's like dressing in fits and he's like posting about his fits. Yeah. And, uh, I walked up and I immediately was like. Like, all oh, dude, I'm so excited to be here to buy a Hyundai from you today. It's so awesome. And, <laughs> oh, and, he, yes. and he was like, he was like, he like looks down at himself. He looks back. He's like, I don't look like a Hyundai dealer. And I start laughing because he's just like, no, I'm you, not. Owned. You don't. If you, you should never have to say that. Yeah. And then, and then about two and a half hours later, I'm playing Melee with Zane and he's behind me. He's watching. And I kind of pause. I turn around. He's like, I don't look like one. <laughs> he's still thinking about it. And I'm he's like, been following you for two hours. Yeah. You just haven't noticed. And he keeps Dude, muttering. I'm like, oh, poor guy. I'm so uh, sorry. You're like, no, nah, man, I, I don't want the warranty. I'm, I'm busy. <laughs> no, 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 it's fine. I actually think the Elantra's washed now. <laughs> Dude, yeah. that, oh my God. Because yeah. he will, uh, what's he going to say about hugs? He, uh, I forget. I'm in too much pain. Go on. You look, you on, look, I want to. I want to lick. When I, I want to slap when your she thigh. hit when she hit one of the first leg ones, I was in so much pain my hearing started to go. Whoa! Have that ever happened, you guys? You got tonight. Yeah, this that, this happens sure. in two ways. You either you're in a lot of pain or you nut extremely hard <laughs> and you like almost pass out. Has that ever happened, you guys? Or it's the intro yeah. to like a Call of Duty animation and <laughs> a grenade it, goes off. Yeah, <laughs> and it goes. Yeah, yeah. it's what Call of Duty depicts. So shell shock light. runs by. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those are the three times that has happens. that ever happened, you guys? Where I nut so <laughs> hard I can't hear. Yeah, you just kind of get lightheaded and you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. okay. Well, I, just I, be, I don't go through shell shock like, 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 like a couple one. times. I just don't want to be, yeah, no, it's not common. I just don't want to feel like I'm crazy. Kind of a, like we need to get you a life like alert, Like a bro. Dunkirk nut. We need to get a life alert around <laughs> your neck. A <laughs> life alert? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I nut so hard I need a life yeah, I think, alert. I think slime's fucking tonight. Let's make sure we all have our phones on. <laughs> Lana, will, will his, will his next shower be painful? Next shower? Next shower? Yeah, will his, no? No. Okay. Shower is good. Shower is good. Cool shower. Yeah. Cold? Cool. Okay. Not cold, okay? You get cold and cool. you blame me. Cool, <laughs> cool not cold. 
Lana! <laughs> <laughs> she said, I had to do this. She said, I had to do this. <laughs> yeah, so the Mr. Beast video, it was like two military guys. They were one-on-one -on -one amazing race style. And then every section of the video was a different obstacle. And the reason I was there is in case Mr. Beast didn't beat them to the next obstacle because they're racing to get there. There, Oh, there was like an influencer there. <laughs> yeah, that, there's person. someone to, yeah. just to intro, like and explain to the viewers what's happening and yeah. to the people who are coming what to I, do. I think, and I would argue that that is, you're a good fit for like host talent. Yeah, yeah. I think so. And so like. I'm better, but you're great. No, you're right. Oh, uh, really? Yes. You really. would have done better than me at the Amaranth Streamer Royale. Think you would event. one take Jake Ugh. like I would wow. in that video. Ugh. I just don't think. I, slime, it's not that big of a deal, man. Just... <laughs> I'm so <laughs> mad at Ludwig. <laughs> so, like, one of the first uh, ones was crazy. They, they invited Hacksaw from Canada. They drove them down. They had Hacksaw lights. is ready. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that no one made that joke? Is that a wax no. bit? Why? Are you fucking that's, kidding me? No, that's the seven-year-old boy? No, I know it's for... I, bone saw is ready. Like... I know where it's from. Oh, I really hate you so much. <laughs> is that for the movie too, guys? That was, uh, I wish you yeah. that, Asher Roth. I wish you culturally uh, that's what, I hate you that, so much, too. That party last That's I what Bone Saw says crazy. right after. Yeah. That's what so, Sam Raimi so cut. that's who they invited. <laughs> they made a lightsaber, and then they had to, like, be, like break a safe. Uh, and that's, like, just one of the obstacles. Uh, and then that was the whole thing. But I think it flopped because, like, one, I think I brought it up on the podcast last time. Yeah, they didn't one of the events on the way, like, fail the or giant, break? It was a giant target, and it was made of vinyl, and it just fucking ripped all the way in half. And so then they brought out a car as backup. This is, like, one of the things. So both teams are there. And they're like, okay, we'll shoot this car with a cannon. It'll be hype. <laughs> Crazy that that's on standby. Yeah. Yeah. yeah unbelievable. <laughs> they parked the car, like, 150 feet away. The cannon, like, two feet. It just basically like falls out. That's so funny. And so and so it's like really underwhelming and they just did whoever was closest, but it was like like a hundred feet still from the car. Yeah. And so they just went to the next obstacle. Uh Ugh. and then the last one they were supposed to fight a sumo wrestler. It's the fattest sumo wrestler Ugh. in like all of Japan. Mm -hmm. The heaviest dude. They brought him out here. He doesn't speak they a word. Hey, they they don't say the out. fattest. Say the best. No, he wasn't the best. He was literally the heaviest. Best. It, we, the best at being the, the heaviest. The best at being the heaviest. Yeah. They brought him there. He doesn't speak a word of English. They 2v1'd him, which apparently is ultimate disrespect, which he lost instantly because he just had uh, he had the coordinates in his butt crack. Ah! The coordinates? Yeah, because it was every obstacle had the coordinates to the next location. Oh. That's crazy because I, I have that right now, and that's the secret it, end of the episode. Yeah, that's where <laughs> Lon is going to find it, and then yeah. she's going to find the treasure where you hide your hair. <laughs> yeah. Put a sucker. Oh, that one's for you. Yeah, yeah. Lon, Lana's fee is in my butt. <laughs> just a wax your way it's out. Not. It's in my wallet. I have it. <laughs> Ow! Uh, and that was... He's going was harder video. on purpose now. <laughs> 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 Instead, I may do the whole leg. It hurt you so bad. That's why I have to divide this and this. I have to go back and forth too many times to divide like small wow. area and won't stick together. Getting That's good my treatment. own technique to help you in this oh, way. Oh, okay? letting out some so trade Lana, secrets. Lana, Lana is making it so it hurts less for me. Although, if you asked me that, I wouldn't have known. <laughs> <laughs> but I do appreciate it. And I think you're doing a great job because I look like a turkey. <laughs> um, I look like a furkey, dude. Oh, God. I, uh, yeah, I do look like Beyond Meat right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a shame about the Mr. Beast video. Well, yeah. good news. I'm invited to a new shoot. Oh, what are we doing? Uh, this one. What are we doing? Yeah, leaked. where are we going? Where are we, we going? Ludwig? What are we doing? Ludwig, no. Where's your smooth bear going yeah, now? He, yeah, I will. I can fly next to the plane. What did he have for us? Yeah, he's gonna tar slime, and then we're gonna try to shoot him uh, uh, like a target, like that Mario Party Two mini game where uh, you have an arrow. Yeah, I'll go, yeah. So, I'll go so far for you. This hurts to put the wax on. By the way, this is gonna really, really hurt. I'll go so far for you. Hey, yeah. we're uh, in the cannon. We're talking. Man, <laughs> this this new video he made, the chocolate uh, factory one. Yeah, I was blown away because the main the main draw is clearly God. that he's recreated this incredible thing from like a book or a movie that we've all that people have like for watched, generations right? talked about recreating almost as like a joke. Yeah, right. Uh, and now he's and now he's finally done it, and not advertised in the thumbnail or the title at all. Is that the end of the video just has Gordon Ramsay in it for like a full five minutes? That's how that's how money Mr. Beast is. Yeah, yeah. yeah it, one of the most the most famous chef in the the world Ugh. is in like a few minutes of the video and it's not important to it at he's all he's like yeah this is my side bitch <laughs> dude gorda looks thick these days 
Yeah, because he's yeah, eating all Gordon's the food. Gordon's in his 60s, bro. He always wears like a medium shirt like he's a young footballer Ugh. that shows off his entire curve. Dude, he looks fine for his age. Sure. I bet his hair comes off like a Lego. Yeah. Dude, his <laughs> hair like that. His hair reminds me. We saw this uh, when we were in Florida for the Amaranth event. Ugh. We saw this crazy souped up yellow truck. It's one of those ones that they've replaced the wheels with like monster truck wheels. Right. And on the back, you know how Ugh. like... You know, there's the fucking, like, blue line, blue flag, blue lives mm -hmm. matter flag. And uh, you know how a lot of those cars, they'll rep the Punisher logo? Yeah. So this oh, dude... Oh, right. with you. This dude has the Punisher logo on the truck, but then the Punisher logo has Trump's toupee on yeah. it. And I was like, damn, that kind of goes crazy. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. That shit is crazy. <laughs> I like when people have stickers to signify, and you know driving by, like, this guy is a hero and a patriot. Yeah. yeah. This and guy's you know a that. true American Thank God. Thank that God. cares. Oh, by the way, uh, Joshy really wants that tattoo. Oh, we do. We gotta to do it before he goes. Yeah, that's I true. He leaves in, dude. He leaves in two days. He leaves uh, the day after tomorrow. Nick, can we get a pyramid he tattoo? He's going to Canada. Yeah, he said he leaves on Wednesday. So can we get a pyramid we, tattoo. We gotta try in two to days? squeeze it in before then. Wait, is he so going easily. straight home from Canada? Can we get a pyramid tattoo yeah. tomorrow? Yeah. Uh, Easy. Uh, ouchie, ouchie, ouchie! Right here, ouchie. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you're so smooth and sweaty. Have you ever, dude? Yeah, look at this. Okay, we get into the look, Archie. You're gonna have a fucking field day censoring this episode. You're gonna have to be really slime careful. Looks like a baby coming out of a womb right now. <laughs> you're I so got the baby sweaty. slime on me. <laughs> yeah, the, the placenta. I, yeah, I and I want to keep it. I want to keep you your keep placenta. placenta. I'll eat it. We'll eat it. You guys together. Can, you got to fry it up, Adam Raguse style. Oh, don't. Here's bring what Raguse. I season my placenta, not Do my pan. <laughs> 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 That's a good one. Uh, but, meanwhile, binging with Babish, uh, we're gonna put the we're gonna put the placenta in the saucepan. I call it placenta. Oh, I wanted to know. I, I wanted to know what's my one thing. What's my one thing? What do you oh, mean? I have a one oh, thing. I so forgot. Slime was about right this. in the topic channel. I want to hear. I that can't shit. talk about that one Ugh. until next week. Okay. Uh, but uh, dude, Aiden's one thing. I was dying laughing at this. So, uh, y'all know Zipper too. Very kind, very sweet. Would never say a mean thing about anyone. He's great. We're driving. No. Uh, we're driving out of nowhere. We're coming home from our trip, and out of nowhere, she goes, "No, Aiden has one thing." Ooh. And I start no. and I start laughing, no. and I'm like, "What do you mean?" And, and she's like, "Well, don't tell him this." And I'm like, "What?" <laughs> well, like, well, I have a no, show. Well, of course, I'm going to tell him. Well, of course, I'm going to tell him. Over to the yard. And she's like, uh, "She's like, yes. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes Aiden will. Uh, we're all hanging out." And, and he'll let out a toot, but he won't say anything. And he just does it, and it's loud, and he just doesn't say anything. And I was like, yeah, he does what? that all the time. And I've noticed this so many and I, Every oh. time I think, he's so weird for not acknowledging that he has loudly farted in a social setting. No. Kill yourself. <laughs> I mean, here's why. Because it's just gotta, it this just, is why every time I get mad at you is because it's always you not having shame about things. And I realized, I thought about this the other day. Like, I love Aiden. He's my friend. I love him. I'll always love him. He's my bear. But, <laughs> <laughs> when your soft little hairless bear, who's hairless like you. Uh, he's just a smooth bear. Is, is I get mad because I expect you to have shame about things because that's what makes us human. Did you know that? But you have no yeah. shame about your farts either. I don't have shame. I have pride and that's different. He has an absence of shame. But also an absence of pride. That's true. But th that makes him even less human because... He, it's called the superego, bro. Freud figured this out while he's beating off to his mom, okay? Do you yeah. think <laughs> that it's weird now being confronted by your friends about how you do this? No, because this is an evolution in my behavior over the years. Because I did not used to be like this. I used to make a large effort to either hold it in gonna say large or, to, uh, <laughs> or to, I guess, own it. Not even an excuse me. And the, we ready? And I, yeah, and the better path now is... I just like let it slide. Wait, know? what's weird though is I think if you burped, you would say excuse me. Mm, not around you guys. Oh, oh, but around Zipper too. Uh, she's. Oh yeah, around mm. around probably a, a Zipper two. She is a dandelion of a person. Zipper two has drawn Sonic the Hedgehog pornography, and I do not need to say excuse me around her. You know her. what? This is cancel Fair. culture. Because yeah, because you, is, you yeah. mess up one time in your uh -huh. life, <laughs> and then everyone's talking you about it. You fuck up one time, spending three hours drawing graphic Sonic pornography. That's right, and they hold it against. And that's forever. your reputation now. And that's and that is her reputation. That's fucked up. We used to be I a don't country. Care about her we, used to, we used to be a goddamn country. How about you say your why ass down to listen when we tell you? We, 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 tell tell you about you, we tell you about Asher Roth. We tell you about Asher Roth. We tell you about farting in public. 
I, you're never receptive. So wait, do you do this around me? I okay. Are you offended? Hold on. I'm just saying I've never seen it, and I feel like my my alpha power is too strong. I probably (laughs) crack. I probably crack this one at least once every two weeks. In front of me. So it's relatively. It happens in. Oh, you're saying it happens once every two weeks in general. Yeah, in general. So sometimes it does happen in front of you. Why don't you say anything? Why don't you make 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 a fun joke about it? Or you just let this poor woman sit there in your stink. Okay, so you know why I don't make a joke around it. You know why I don't make a joke about it around you. Ugh. Is uh is because it's my my toots are small. And he doesn't well, feel man enough. No, you and know they don't. You know they don't really stack him. up against you. With him, it would be. Uh, hypocr- what would I, it would be hypocritical. It would be hypocritical if you found them funny and you made a joke. Yeah, he, because he complains about. Because you can't complain yeah. when he does it. But I, I also better. don't think mine are funny. It's just like, oh damn, that one. That's yeah, fine. That one's lame. Out. Farts, you got funny. They are very. They're not small enough to be like funny. Where it's like. You're also, like LMAO. I think I would hate it if you both were people who like making jokes about your farts and start farting like it's the intro to Tropic Thunder and you're both Jack Black and you're the farty fartinsons. Are, ta- are you talking about Robert Downey Jr.? No, it's Jack Black at the intro of it. Oh, okay. He plays multiple characters who all fart. Oh, I see what you're saying. They're yeah. all different people. And that's you and Aiden if you both were into that. So I'm glad you don't. Yeah, I mean, if I had another me, it'd be a little wild in the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'd be terrible. Also, let me ask you, Ludwig. You so thing, you may not know this about Ludwig. All you bears out there, he hates getting hot. He hates being warm. Me too. Thing. Me too. I'm. Remember, I'm, remember too. when we were looking at the house that we live in, or that you guys live in now, uh, and we were driving around. And it was really hot, and he, he was probably the most pissy I ever saw him <gasps> because it was really, really hot in Cutie's car, and we just like we had to like stop and turn on the AC, and he was just like not having it. He was like throwing a fit. And I, all, fit? and I remember that Probably. because when my friends throw fits, I'm like, well, I don't want to get him hot anymore. Yeah. He's a little hot, hot bear. Bother. You're like me. Now, let it me makes ask me you, irritable. It's really hot right now. Uh-huh. How are you guys doing? I'm doing all right. I'm thinking about it every couple seconds. I'm a little, I'm a little <laughs> sweaty, but it's mostly good. How about you guys take off your shirts and join me in the parade? I don't think that would make me feel better. When I was a young boy. Last time? My father. Uh, we're going to learn about that in the sexual harassment course, by the way. Where you don't ask. Whoa, people to that take one looks off. like it was painful. You see his leg over there? Yeah, it's dude. Marked. They're all painful. Well, I know, but that one's no, marked. Surely not all of them. I oh, feel like. Oh, dude. <laughs> what are you laughing about? Because I just read one of the topics I put down. So we uh, slime moved out. We talked about it last episode, and we made slime's room another guest room, and Nick Allen stayed in it. And he showered in your shower, and you left a few things behind. <laughs> oh, dude. And so, <laughs> he told me about this. Yeah. And so he, he's like, I'm like, is everything good in the room? He's like, yeah, it's all great. But like, Slime has like weird stuff in his bathroom. And like, I go in a check, and he has like tar shampoo. Yeah. Yeah. It looks what? like you. It looks like you took an empty shampoo bottle and filled it in like the oil sands. Yeah. So it, it's like Neutrogena, like tar something shampoo. It's very, it's very, it smells like tires. And it's very hardcore. It's like, it's really good for your scalp. It, You're not supposed to use it a lot, but I got it when I started shaving my head and I was like, well, you know, scalp care, which I do. I lotion my head and shit. It's a good thing. It smells like tires because it looks like if it's solidified, that's what tires are made of. Uh, yeah. It does look like a, a melted tire. The four, the four in one shampoo, conditioner, motor oil. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but he, <laughs> Nick Allen, he messaged me on Slack and he was like, Yo, what the fuck is that shit that I put in my hair? I do love, I do love, because we all message Nick Allen on Discord and Slack, so the fact that it's on Slack directly implies that, that this is business. Uh, this is yeah, serious. Yeah. I don't know how many hair, hair years Nick Allen had left, but it went down. No, no, I said it's good for your hair. No. Which it is. Wait, you think I don't know shit about what's so I go, keeping hair? So I, actually, I go to clearly, you, I go clearly to the, you didn't care enough. <laughs> I go on down to the La Brea tar pits and I, I get my head involved. You're telling me that's good for me. Yes, if you if you if you see some road construction and you put your hand on the ground and then run it through your fucking silky yeah. mane, you're good for All a right. year. Noted. Uh, but yeah, also um, the fucking the, someone posted on the subreddit. Ever since Ludwig went to the Angels game, they have lost like eleven games in a row. Really? Oh, yeah. yeah. You t- what? You're happy? No, I'm. <laughs> I'm- I'm not happy at all. No. <laughs> like someone posted the record, and it was extremely funny. It fucking rolled. It was rolled. like two weeks ago. I, the, the, I just the oh, I, I bought popcorn. I talked to the leprechaun with the coin. I, <laughs> why, I don't know why, what I could have done. Yeah, it's a curse of Ludwig, okay? <laughs> it is a Ludwig curse, so maybe that helped out too. Where did your like, shirt come off? Shohei buddy? Otani, if you're listening, you give me season tickets, I go back. I, you know, the curse gets lifted. Yeah. 
Hold it, withhold it from them. I'm withholding it from you all. I like that. You baseball wow. lovers. My, my guilty pleasure right now, by the way, after talking so much shit about baseball on the podcast and on the Patreon episodes, has been watching John Boy videos like a oh, lot. Yeah. He's great. I mean, John yeah. Boy's the goat. Yeah, I he's still fucking, hate baseball. He's Wait, you're saying John Boy? John, John Boy. Or John Boy, who John does Boy. The, the lip reading. The lip reading. Or, not lip reading. And the breakdowns. The breakdowns. Yeah. Yeah. That's why my breakdown videos go. No, John, John Bois made a, the E equals MC vagina video. I heard his videos are great. I just haven't watched them. Also, he's, he's have you watched my video? Thumb my up. breakdown of the, the handshake at Smash World Tour? Yeah. Yeah, model after that. You like that you shit? You know what's fucked yeah, up? Great you just, you're following my footsteps. You're following you dad's footsteps. About? No, but, no, that's not true because you've never made anything quite like Quincy Boys. No, no, no. No, no hair. I don't see hair there. He's following in my footsteps because I watch... Oh, it's time for cock and ball. Oh, oh wow! Are you guys hot? Yeah, I'm you guys hot. hot. Real quick, take this. We're about take these we're, off. We're about to do it. We're I'm gonna take my my shorts off. Yeah, and uh, and we're gonna do the. the oh, we gotta subject Archie the craziest to this part. But I do. I I uh, I just wanted to ask you, Ludwig, how am I following in your footsteps? Because I don't see you fucking greased up like this. Okay, well, uh, not this part. All right, not getting. Oh, so I've carved my own path. Bald and wild. <laughs> I'm talking specifically about YouTubers that you like watching. John Boy, me, I watch first. Adam Ragusea, me, I watch first. <laughs> it's just you just you're just finding out. And then he and then he messaged me a fucking uh, a video from Drew Gooden. Yeah, was like, this guy's funny. The Tom Brady one. You like to Drew Gooden video? Yeah, why? That's He's crazy. Funny. I think I'm, I'm surprised he's not by funny. that. I think I'm, I'm surprised. Just, that seems like a guy that you would be mad at. Yeah, I watched something. the Tom Brady video mm -hmm. and I thought his timing was good and his cuts were good. I think he cuts a little too quick and stuff, but you know, I had some notes, Drew. But I thought it was great. <laughs> it was great. I thought it was great. What the fuck? You think I'm an evil guy? Yeah. I hate streamers. I don't think you're, don't okay? think you're evil. I yeah. just think you are walking in the footsteps of the YouTubers I like. So anyway, the next few for you, just so you know, is going to be Eric. Ben Shapiro, Steven Crowder. <laughs> these He's so are loud. Jordan Peterson. These are my big. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna love Your these guys soon. These yeah. are the elite four of the, uh, the uh -huh. Pokemon universe that you is YouTube. What? Because it is about changing his mind. Uh -huh. I feel like he could change his mind. Yeah, Brazilian. All right, so let's just take him off. All right, here okay, we go. Okay, we're probably ready? gonna. We go. The rest of the podcast will likely be with this camera angle. So how's it how going? You, how do you think? How do you think California sexual harassment laws handles this? I don't know if you like. Maybe we could do a bit, not a lot. I think we just put a big sensor. The big sensor is fine. Oh, maybe. No, that's what I'm saying. It, it, the multiple question, the multiple choice question on the test, where it's like, if your coworker is getting a Brazilian in front of you and, and you're uh, part of the activity, poor, yeah. then it it doesn't help that it's so hot. <laughs> Oh, dude, God, this is so penis. funny. This is so funny. Why is it so gray? <laughs> Yann has, like has looked on the barrel of the that's gun. One thing, that's one thing. <laughs> Zippers I, I, Zipper has the day did, off, by the way. Yann is here. I've, I've never thought about is that uh, when you when you keep your foreskin, your penis stays stays nice and red, full of color. Yeah, like a dog. Like it should. Yeah. But yeah, this Mike penis got some miles you got on a, it, You bro. got a dull penis. It looks like aged meat. <laughs> It looks like a Winco stick, bro. My, I got some miles on it, bro. Also, I got a, I got a this, nice, this, I got a nice pink little tip. This, this was a bit in literally episode one of Workaholics. Like, why is your dick so tan? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I was like, uh, yes, yeah. <laughs> the tan dick. My brotherhood. I also, so there's a, I have a mole don't, on my dick. Let's not do a, not do a science experiment. Do you want to see the mole? I don't, know. I don't do you want to see the mole? I want to see your mole. Oh, I want to see the mole. Oh, just, 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 Lana's busy. Lana's busy. All right. Uh, but, uh, oh, and Yan, when you accepted the job, did you think you would see this? No. <laughs> right. I feel so bad too because I like showered and like I, I like really cleaned my entire body. I was like, this this person, this professional is gonna have to touch my most private parts. And then it just we had to turn off the AC because of the power surge. And it just got so sweaty. Oh, uh, so you've got and I swamp feel like, dick I just now. feel like a sweaty guy. Oh my god, Holy uh, that shit, looks dude. like it is this going is, to be. This looks like so it's going to be bad, dude. Bad. Now, Yan, can I ask you a question? Do you think that it is okay in the workplace for someone uh, to Yan, ask you to look at dude, someone else's penis? Yan, Yan <laughs> has, a, Yan has the god angle right now, yeah. if I may. Oh, spread wider for Yan. If if you, dude, if you spread much wider, Yan is going to see God. Because Yan's also <laughs> getting, Yan's also getting butt. Yeah. Yan gets butt. Yan's gonna get everything. That's great. 
You have such a bald penis. I feel like this is really going to hurt or it's not going to hurt at all. She said it was Dude. the most painful, if that makes you feel better. Do, yeah, do whatever you feel is necessary. Yeah, that's that's Yeah, great. whatever you got to do. Whatever, whatever is Never best. Turn that one on, right? I don't know that how AC? to... No. You want it on, bud? I what? don't care. It's up to you guys. You, you, you should try to hit the... I, uh, I care most about what she is like, you know, I don't know what she's trying to do. You should try, when right before she pulls, you should try to hit the high note and take me on. Oh. Scared? Yeah. I would yeah. be scared yeah, if I was here. I would, yeah. This is the part, this is the first part of it where I'm like, yeah, I wouldn't want this to happen to me. But here's the thing about you that you don't share with Slime. He could be sleeping in a closet and he wouldn't mind. Right. You, you could never, Aiden. You, could you, never. Got, you got a little fan on it. You don't I think I could sleep in a closet? My <laughs> not, not like this guy. You, the only reason I have a bed oh. frame is because you built it for me. I am a hero. Okay. I'm ready. Oh, man. This is so crazy. I, I want to play the song from 2001 Space Odyssey where the monkeys figure out fire. This uh, is... Uh, oh, dude. You, want, you want me to hold your deep hand? Breath, can you deep breath. Can, can you tell the audio listeners, like, where is this going right now? Oh, uh, this is on the left side of uh, my... It's, like, underneath. It's kind of, like, where my butt cheek and, like, beneath my balls meet. Uh, and this taint. It's, well, it's, like, the left side of the taint and the inner thigh. And, um... Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy that this is... <laughs> Woo! Mama. Hey, just to, well, I'd like to take this moment to say thank you to our patrons who, <sighs> who made sure we got here. Yeah, thank you all. Oh, my God. <sighs> oh! <laughs> oh, my oh, it caught. God. It oh caught. God. I'm good. Oh, no. it's, a, it's about the pilot, not the plane. <laughs> <laughs> Amen. Do you think Tom Cruise has gotten his balls waxed? Hundred percent. Of course. It's it's part of the Scientology regime. He do regiment. anything for a role. And then, and then there is does one big. He does strip. his own stunts. There's he a does producer. His own there's stunts. a producer who's like, we have a guy who, and we're gonna shave his balls for like the scene in the movie where you lose your ball hair, and he goes, no, <laughs> I've been growing them out for 17 years. <laughs> I'll do the waxing myself too. There's, shit like Dumbledore's there's, like, there's like a GQ video about him like talking about his most his most thought out roles and he's like, Yeah, I climbed the Burj Khalifa, I hung off the side of that plane, and I got my balls waxed. Okay. <laughs> this one is interesting to me because this is on your penis. Yeah, so this is actually going up the shaft and, and sort of the the base in oh, the left area dude, again. This one, I don't because penis skin is loose. I don't It is loose. Because it's hard, you, to, do maybe it, it's hard you. to do a clean pole. Maybe hey, for well, you. It's it, also for you to be clear, so yeah. soft. You're the one right with now. wax on your dick hey, right now. Dude, okay. If I had a bone right now, you guys be so impressed by the way <laughs> dude if you could i'm not kidding my shit looks gorgeous well i feel like i feel like lana's ah! better judge than us ah! okay oh, oh my god for a moment Bro. for like for like three frames of my life i forgot there was wax so i just saw her oh. pull yellow I stuff just out like of pulling butt. out hair raw yeah, yeah i was yeah. like whoa yeah so we usually do the gooch area without <laughs> any wax he just has like a hive of bees in his asshole they're pulling dude, out the honey. Dude. Dude. Kicking hoss, kicking hoss. This is so crazy. Hey. Dude, I do not want to. Oh. oh, you don't want to do this? Oh, so you, oh, you don't want to join the Marines? Yeah, so it's you a, don't want to join the Marines? It's actually about me now. Mm, Shout out to the sponsor of the podcast, Kids Bop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, there's another one on the spreadsheet for Ludwig making that joke, by the way. Uh, influencers. Wow. Uh <sighs> I've been playing a lot of Warzone. Well, dude. Like Have you? Yeah, I've been playing. I'm addicted to Warzone. Oh, solo? Uh, no, I played in full squads, dude. With who? The who boys? are you playing with? I play with Ryan. I play with Steve. I was thinking about this. So like, I, I, who is Steve? Oh, this is my balls. Steve, oh, Steve is, is a... Steve, Steve will do it from Nuck Boys. Steve is the DP director of Ludwig's uh, car explosion shoot. Uh, or DP, uh, sorry. He's, he's a DP director, and he was the DP on that. Dan was the director. Right. Um, and uh, it's funny, because he's actually very good at Warzone. And it's funny because like no, no, up, a lot of up, times. Up. Oh! 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 Is it over? Is it over? Is that yeah, one over? A, that one's that one's off. Oh my I... god! Oh, so so I just to just to oh recap god. just to recap this. Lana, Lana eyes. Lana's eyes. So gross. Lana put oh uh, a bunch of wax on the so on the bad. shaft. Ah, uh, Tony Lashner, welcome to Jackass. <laughs> ah! Oh my god, it's so gross, dude. There's so much hair left, dude. Oh my oh, fucking god. Fuck. 
So so he oh, he had it looks like he I left a, a gusher under my shoe for oh, a year. Oh dude, that I is so cool. Like she caught a, <laughs> she caught a fucking big mouth bass. Yeah, oh. Mana, hold it up. Oh. Oh. Ah! God damn it! It's crazy because Lana's ripping it so like you rip it so like powerfully and then you hold it up like a kid with your drawing, yeah. <laughs> like so pridefully and it's it's awesome. Oh my You're doing great. Fuck <laughs> this is kind of uh. like. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You're doing, a, kinda, you're doing a fantastic job. By it's the just way. so funny because it's his penis. Doing the greatest job ever. It's oh. kind of like what it would sound okay. like if you were crowning, I feel like. This is going to be such an intense like feeling that you experience. You'll never be able to come again. It's That's gonna, not true. It's going to take away all... You try me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, by the way, I have a thing for you. What's that? I got a, I got a thing. Like, what? Like Zipper 2 had a thing for Aiden. Oh, what's my thing? I got a... Th your thing? You got some things. Oh, heavy cream when you make fucking pasta sauce? Kill yourself. Okay, that's not. Wait, that's that's, like no, the that's most, normal. That's he's, very he's normal. In a, he's in a fragile you buy state that, right you buy now. That shit every single time. Oh, and then oh no, that part's rational. Stack up in the fridge. Yeah, yeah, that that's part's true. rational. That's that part's rational. No, th none of that is the thing. I've been rational. The thing is how you are now mean to Durs, the older cat in the house. <laughs> now that Coots is around. Look, look. Mean is a strong word. No, you because we got the new cat Coots, who's very cute, who I've milked for five YouTube videos. God bless your heart, Coots. Dad bear. And then Durs will be walking around minding his own business. It's been a bit of a hard transition. You'll talk some shit because Durs is like not so fond. And then and then Nick will see Durs and go, uh, "How's it going? Hey, how's washed up old guy in the house? Huh? <laughs> oh shit, not no, doing so hot anymore." Say is I go, "Oh, what's up? It's Cat Two. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Cat with a oh, number. Dude, in remember it. when we used to love you? Doesn't happen anymore. Look, huh? you, you saw me and Durs on the Big Joe. I did. Yes, we that made me happy. In. Being mean to Durs is really funny no, right now. No, it's not. Because he's so sulky. He's, yeah. he's salty about so it. So he yeah. needs support, and you guys are being mean. I'm nice to him. You've made jokes, and I've heard them, and I called you out when you did it. That's true. But I, I also call him Cadbury. Yeah, that me part's and, good. You do that to all animals. Me and Durs are working yeah. through some stuff right now. You're Well, he doesn't fucking love you. Not anymore. Because it's impossible for anyone to love you for too long. That's, well, that's true. That hey, tiny hey, little say fan. It, say it twice for the people in the back. It's impossible for anyone to love you. His tiny, tiny, tiny little dick fan <laughs> that is giving us a little bit of a of a both a breeze and an odor. It's making my day so much Dude, better. Dude, think about it. it. We are just getting... Wait. Ah! 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 Oh, you're such a beast, Dude. bro. Dude. We are getting women, hair. Women it looks do like this. An women do this all the time. What? Yeah. Well, I feel like. Okay, that's good. That's the, okay. I got it. The most hurting part. I just got it because I'm a <gasps> champion and a veteran. You are ready. a champion. I have. I'm with you. They should make a memorial day for people who get waxed. <sighs> Look, I'm gonna. You guys want me oh. to set this fan up for us? I could do that. I'm all right. Ah! I, if you need oh. it, I, I can. We should, I, maybe uh, we should have to suffer a Look, little bit. Look, I'm too. just saying. I feel a lot better with my shirt off. I think it's funny that we're getting air that blows through his dick before it hits yeah, us. It is, yeah, yeah, at the very least, yeah. yeah. We're we definitely getting little wax and dick particles. No one smelled your dick more than us today. Uh, you're welcome. Today. <laughs> Other days. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, the, no the, gooch, the gooch is now being administered. Oh, God. Administered? He sounds like a Coyote Peterson. <laughs> that's that's death. About to get ah! stung. That's death. Ah! <laughs> I want to say. Dude, Coyote Peterson, but he only gets stung in the balls. Ah! Coyote God Peterson, but he's Ow! getting his asshole ah! waxed. Oh my god, I hate seeing my friend Snaggedy. I thought it would be funny. No, it's no, not funny. This is not cool. Ah! <laughs> oh, this is less fun. Is it, is it, you got it all? That hair's gross. Oh, fuck me, dude. That's hurt so fucking bad. Have you bad. seen Coyote Peterson slime? He's a fellow he, brother because he, he's He'd bald. like Coyote Peterson. Wait, uh, we don't have to censor anything if I just crop on his okay. face. You're fine. Yeah. yeah, let's do that. So Coyote Peterson's a guy whose content is uh, getting stung by like the more and more painful insects. Yeah. So he'll be like, I'm Coyote Peterson, and this is the Hornet Wasp going in for a... Kind of like Wild Boys. Yeah, 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 but it, like much more scientific. Yeah, but he's approaching it from a very scientific yeah. perspective, yeah. And I feel like that's how, what you're like when you announce it's on your gooch, and she's going for the tear. Yeah, and, that's and, my Adam Ragusea. And he very scientifically will explain the pain. He's like, yeah. I can feel it right now, scorching through my arm. <laughs> There's a numbness to it. And, yeah. uh, and that's it, you. It, this, is a, this, is a, this is more of a body high, this type of wax. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I also want I want to see you like swim or something after this. I want to see oh, I wanna, so fast. I want to throw you down a slip and slide. Oh, so Dude, fast. Dude, yes. Have you ever waxed a swimmer like an athlete? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Is it mostly like cosmetic? They like swim, they swim faster. Yes, you. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, I want, let's race after this. Oh, I'm on so foot smoky, bro. Smoky's so foot. good. <laughs> no, irrelevant to the hair. <laughs> oh, it's smoky. Yeah. I smooth bear. I smoky. So I do want to do that as a yard special. 
We do a what foot race? race. I want to do one mile race. Oh, one mile so different. I want to run a mile and see who's the fastest, who's the slowest. Aiden is like Aiden well, wins the mile. Literally, he's moving his body like a cocky asshole right now because he thinks he's gonna win. Yeah, he, he has a cocky he face on right long now. long distance running. He's not gonna beat me. I will win. What is your fastest <laughs> mile time? I doubt, it's not even a conversation. So fastest mile time on three. Twisted. Fastest mile time Aiden on three. Will win. Wait, fastest mile Wait, time on ever? three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, Wait, two, two, three, five, five forty-nine. Oh, you guys are kind of beat. Dude, you said one second underneath him. Yeah. Mine's like 603 Also, or hold on. Mine was uh, 540, and uh, it was in a three-mile race. Maybe I've hit under six. Mine was 539, so my, my, my and it was all last, time, it was my last all time year. My all-time was in a race it was last that year. went on for two more oh, miles. I am faster than you. I ran three sub-six miles in that race. I'm allowed to push you during the race. Wait, why? Because it will make me but do better. But you said that you were faster. Yeah, I thought you were faster. Well... I actually remembered his time. And said, I, well, look, we do a mile, I lose. We do a short burst, I have a fighting chance. Like a like a forty if we meter. Do, if yeah. we do, yeah. If we did like hundred well, meter, I think Nick we do win. the mile. We can do. You both. also might win if we, we do hundred meter. No, I'm slow. You think? Yeah, I know. You got short legs, though. I have very short legs. <laughs> you look like you look like the shooby version of slime <laughs> in real life. I do. I'm like one of the fucking thumbs <laughs> from Spy Kids Dude, 3. There's like just, I, I also look like the shooting version. There's just so much <laughs> hair. There's so much hair here. Yeah, you got so much cock and ball hair. I know. Dude, it's going to grow, grow back, and then it's going to be like... Little, really? It'll probably take a while, but it's going to be little spiky hairs. Yeah. I'll, no, it'll look like Spinner Mason from Degrassi. You ran a 539 last year? No, I ran a 555 seven years ago. I just remembered your time. It said one second less because okay. I knew it would bother you. That was convenient, wasn't yeah. it? You're a fast reactor. I know. That was good. You're a nuclear reactor, yeah. bro. Uh, One of the best. Uh, oh, by I, the way. Oh, God. The underside I, of I, my ball sack yeah. is being waxed was, right was, now. It's very hot and warm. That might feel nice, though, right? Yeah. Th yeah. That's what it'll feel. That's the, that's the thing. It might that's feel good. The word. You might like it. Well, you're gonna, uh, look, I was just going to say I ran a mile recently for the first time in a very long time. I am not impressive. What was it? It was like 35. It was like somewhere eight to nine minutes. Yeah. And it was hard. I was like, I couldn't do two. I think I could sub eight if I'm pushing. But uh, I don't think I'd sub seven. My climbs. They're getting fucking. Oh. I keep looking at it. It's so gross. Lana, can I so do one? Why do we? Can oh, I pull off You want to do one of these? Yeah. No, I don't want to do it. I don't, I don't do know, no. man. No. Yeah. He's a, yeah, I need a professional. Yeah. Could I do his butt cheek? You do my butt cheek. I'm fine with that. I don't have much hair there. Okay, firm handshakes. But you don't get to, you You're don't such get a pussy for not letting me rip no, the it, hair it, off it, your cock. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Get in, get in the ring or don't talk to me. I have done worse things. Name one thing that was worse than this. When I ah! had to switch from Twitch to YouTube. <laughs> for for, I, I for went to, 30 million dollars. I went to Disneyland seven days in one scary. week. Uh... You hear me, Dexerto? It's thirty million, and I'm confirming no, it now. You million. can make a third article about it's how not, it's thirty million. It's not thirty million. What are you gonna say? Uh, happy Pride Month. Happy Pride Month. Did, should we make our Twitter gay? <laughs> yeah, I do. Uh, so Ludwig, 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 Ludwig was in the car, and he's like, "For Pride Month, we should we should make our Twitter gay for only twenty eight days." And like, and like, cut it off two days early to show yeah. that we really don't care. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. I said cut it off early to show that it's not just for the month. You know, we should just put Prezo as our profile picture. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd be down with that for Pride Month. Yeah, we could do just the de like his profile picture, the deer, so that it's confusing. <laughs> Did to you people. see the phase post? That was no. insane. No, oh, oh, yeah, like it, phase uh, virus. Yeah, so phase. there's phase in like there's a few funny posts because all the companies start posting like happy yeah. pride. And like specifically, there was like one from the U.S. Marines yeah. that had bullets that were rainbow, dude, oh, dude. which is ridiculous. The Marines one was so, <laughs> dude, it's it was. Just, it's just Ram Ranch. Yeah. It was <laughs> don't ask, don't tell like two years ago, bro. Yeah. Like. Also, like Trump's whole thing about like not letting trans people join the military or something like that. Yeah, was it, that was like really recent. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. What the fuck are you and doing? Then, and then there was one but, forum up. I like, from, I like the idea of gay bullets though. Gay bullets. Gay bullets. <laughs> we shoot gay bullets now. It's yeah. like it's like the boogie ball in Fortnite. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> they make you dance to YMCA. It's okay if civilians die if the soldiers are gay. Right. Yeah, that's what the military is telling. Called yeah. gay imperialism. <laughs> you can't hate it or you're canceled. Yeah, it's homophobic <laughs> if you hate the gay. I'm gonna make a gay military that's only gay, and you're <laughs> you're actually canceled. Uh, 
And then the other one was like NASCAR did one. And obviously, like none of the NASCAR fans are like, hell yeah, right. brother. But FaZe was similar because FaZe Clan is like, dude, let me play Call of Duty and say slurs and fucking eat popcorn. Yeah, yeah their brand is very aligned with dude bro. <laughs> FaZe and the Marines are, are the same. Dude, the pe- oh! Look. Oh! Ooh, that was ah! a, this is a penis one. Oh! oh. God damn it. God damn it. The His penis body ones look like bad. He was getting taken over by the devil. <laughs> like, this like, is, like we need a cross and garlic. This is kind of like a scene in Alien. Yeah. <laughs> So anyway, FaZe makes the post, and it's like, happy pride, gay FaZe logo. I could probably go on my old PC when I, when I used to play COD. I could probably find a video of a FaZe member calling me a gay slur. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Pretty easily. That's probably yeah. easy to do. Yeah. You probably hey, Google happy it. Happy pride, you Happy posted. pride yeah. month. Happy, dude, that's a fucking happy great Happy pride post. month, at Banks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, they, so they drop the tweet. One of the FaZe members, FaZe Virus, immediately replies in like a quote retweet or something, and he's like, hey, just so everybody knows, I don't stand with this at all uh, uh, and I bold. don't support any of this and uh, and then deletes it obviously was he, was he making like a dumb stupid joke or was he serious no, no. Like, he was serious okay. dead ass on G every so he's um, the only phase member from Saudi Arabia he's Muslim okay. and uh, and like most of his tweets are in Arabic and this is like the one English tweet that was like by the way don't stand with the gays uh, and then he deletes it and and I called it out on stream and then I got a shit ton of DMs from people that were like bro all he said is he doesn't support it <laughs> That's but not crazy. that he's against Didn't it. Didn't he do like you know, There's the whole story in the Bible where Lot goes to Sodom in Gomorrah in fucking. Bro, we didn't watch One Piece. I, I don't. Care. I actually, I actually don't know what you're talking about right now. <laughs> this is the. It's the whole thing in the Bible that's against homosexuality. Yeah. There's this guy who goes. Oh, God. And God's like, hey, clear out the gay people there, and then they continue to be gay. So he burns <sighs> down the village, and the village oh. was called Sodom, which is why they call it sodomy. Whoa! Yeah, Wait, okay, what? You're good. I, didn't I know heard that. sodomy. I immediately thought sodomy. Sodomy is two men having love with yeah, each other. Yeah, okay, I know that part. No, Aiden. So thank you. So that when yeah. a guy loves a guy, yeah. it's Guys, called the gay. right side of my penis had all the hair ripped out of it, and it's like we're you talking. Don't even dude, we are about, having a conversation. Yeah, we're talking shop gay right now. Right if you now. could just you quiet down. Oh, do you want to there? silence conversations <laughs> around gay topics? <laughs> yeah. You okay. want us to stop being so vocal? I, I think the main it. thing is like, <laughs> reg- like regardless of his personal beliefs, which I think is like, uh, you know, maybe fucking work through that. Uh, it's crazy that you would just not say nothing. Yeah, yeah. It's well, it's, what's it crazy is, it is easy you have if you're a, a problematic you have person the to easiest, just not say anything. You have the easiest job in the world, and all you have to do is not say anything. But what was funny to me is most of the people defending him weren't other Muslim people who were like, hey, we devoutly support no, the Quran. It was, it was like, just dude bros who aren't religious who were like, yeah, I don't stand with gay people either. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I saw I, that. I'll piggyback off this Muslim guy real quick. That I'll, they, that I'll, they I'll, didn't they that they didn't know existed up until this hit that like they the will news. not yeah. support in a year when there will be some problem. Oh, this is right on my dick. Oh, this is on the ball sack. Oh, it's on my ball sack. On the ball sack. <laughs> Baby, <laughs> I want to watch this one up close dude, in I HD. I really don't, I don't like watching dude, him whimper. I, dude, you're blocking the camera of him. Like. I just wanted to see his asshole. So we're <laughs> audio audio listeners. We are now on the part of your ball sack that is right below your your penis. This feels and like a scene in like Neon Genesis Evangelion, <laughs> where, where you're getting dude. turned into like a mecca, and we have to oh, shave you. Dude, this is not. Uh, uh, he's moaning like it hurts. Like, like it hurts. I want He's probably to, faking. I'm helping the audio listeners. Oh my lord. The top of his pubis looks really bald now. <laughs> which is good. That's That part's all cleared up. This it's, is insane. Slime, walk me Girls through. Girls do this all the time. I'm a hero. I'm going to give you five erogenous zones. I want you to rank one most painful, five least painful, all in this cock and ball area. Okay. Uh, we got shaft, pubis, balls, gooch, and then like thigh, like surrounding pubis- area. The pubis area, is right the above the shaft. The pubis was the most uh, difficult journey that I took. Number uh, one, painful. It was the most painful. Uh huh. I think uh, on the side of the penis, uh, underneath, like thigh, penis, like strip. Oh, here we go. Here's ball sack. Hello. Oh God. Hello world. Hello my baby. Hello oh. my darling. Ah. Oof. I gotta get there. You got that. You got this, Lana. You got this. Come on. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you're born to kill, Lana. So you're born clutch. to kill. You're so clutch. Born to oh. kill, bro. You're born to kill. <laughs> Uh, so walk. It's they, pubis one. It's is it thigh two gooch two. Gooch was really really difficult. Gooch yeah. Two. Uh, I think I'll just say most painful was the pubis, and then as you kind of like 
Uh, I'm surprised by that. I don't know, bro. It all really It's a very hurts. sensitive he area. He might be a little... I, he looks cloudy in the mind right now. It's, Maybe we shouldn't ask him too it's, many questions. Honestly, it's like... I, it doesn't hurt any less to me for me to prefer anything except the pubis. That part was like, that's too much. Right. And I don't want to do that again. I would have thought that would have been the nicer part. I would have thought the hard part would be your ball sack. Because it's like just so... It's so hard to get taught. I don't think there's enough nerve endings on the ball sack for that to be the most painful. Like oh, the shaft, bleeding. His balls are bleeding. Dude, that's Whoa. tight. I've never I bleed, seen. I bleed from my art. I've never seen a whole testicle bleed. Really? Yeah. I've only uh, seen like little little nicks when you shave. Yeah, no! yeah, I guess. Oh no. <laughs> it's just so bit. This is oh. oh you don't like it? It's so much away. It's so hard. You don't look away. It's so, hard, the blood, it's so much less fun than I thought it would be. <laughs> the blood you bleed when you wax is so much different from normal blood because it comes out like one of those Play-Doh things where you yeah. push it up and it goes in like yeah. seventy like different. Patchy yeah, blood. It's like we're yeah. making French fries. Yeah, yeah. The Play-Doh. The French fry. Right, Play-Doh. This is like French fries. My God, you are you're a soldier, bud. Bad man. Jesus. Dan, how you holding up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know if Yan was uh, prepped on exactly his uh, vantage point he was gonna have, but Is that why Zipper said he was sick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Zipper all of a sudden. <laughs> Zipper found a way out. I have of to this go to the way. church store. I'm gonna be gone for about <laughs> three hours. Oh man, yeah, everyone. Uh, oh, okay, so there's a lot of this is the base now of the peep and uh, oh, the peepus. Like, the the, the peepus. Yeah, that's what they, it's called the peepus. Yeah, it's the peepus pogus, not the peepus majora. <laughs> peepus pogus, Adrian. <laughs> oh, hey, he's still with us. Yeah, he's still in there he, somewhere. Yeah, you can still make. <laughs> yeah, he's still roasting. Can you hear us? Can you hear us, buddy? Alive. <laughs> Do your uh, best stance. What if is you're it? With what us. is this? Is this like different wax? I guess different because of a uh, different type of hair. Oh. So for the big one, I think, but that's why I grab everything. I don't miss any any hair. It's like uh, it's like a it's like a different we, grit of sandpaper. We wouldn't want yeah. any to be missed. Would you we don't now? miss, bro? <laughs> a lot of don't miss. <laughs> I'll say it again. <laughs> that's right. Well, look, maybe maybe I can talk. I think he's earned it. We'll talk about why slime was right. Uh, yeah, why what? is slime right? I wasn't gonna bring it up. Just because he's in pain doesn't mean we have to give so, it to him. Uh, why not? So you can be a great reason. Reason. You, guys nice you, guys when, you guys remember when slime said that very controversial thing on the yard episode, right? When he made the uh, claim about the, the dead kid. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah. Dick stuff, and he was like, "Well, it'd be fine if they're dead." Dance offended me by and, the way. And we were all like, "No, you're weird and wrong and crazy for that." Well, um, I saw uh, David Cronenberg's new movie, Crimes of the Future, in Ugh. theaters. Uh, it was a great film. I suggest seeing it. But there's a dead kid dick in the movie. Really? What? And uh, I was not expecting that. It's on. <laughs> it's on screen for like five minutes. That's what? and uh, and I'm sitting there and I'm watching it and I go, oh my god, I have to either say slime was right or say I'm a pedophile <laughs> because I'm looking at one right now and I'm either doing something that is morally bankrupt or I am not. Yeah. And welcome. Slime was right. Welcome to being right. See, the, the whole reason, by the way, that joke appeared is because I was just trying to make sure Ludwig wasn't correct. Yeah, that's and what... I went, the, and I went all the way. That's what the foundation of the joke was never conceding. I just can't believe he wins. You were right. I'm so goaded. You were right. I really, I really do have it all, don't I? Yeah, well, I see. This is why you don't give it to him. I didn't look. <laughs> even in pain. <laughs> I felt like I owed it to him. I felt like I, in when the, I in watched this moment, him, I was like, I have to tell him. You watched Lana rip my fucking ball hairs <laughs> off, and you're like, you know what? He earned it. <laughs> he earned it, yeah. <sighs> He's been a good boy. Oh, oh I, when he twitches, thigh. I twitch. His whole Some body upper, rise. Upper hair on the thigh, hips. So, we're, we're getting pretty close to the end. So here just now. about, like, so there's just not about a lot of hair left. No. As painful as a tattoo, you think? Like just about, it's more painful. It's just so same. Gen, gen, genuinely same. more painful oh. than than the most pain I've experienced, which was my bicep in this tattoo, which more, isn't a lot. Is this the most painful thing you've ever done? No, it was when I broke my arm. Oh really? That was that. Oh, yeah, man. that really hurt. That'll do it. You know, <laughs> we're, we're we must be getting like. Does he have my? Ah! Oh. Ah. Bro, the, the just butt. stand up and look at his whole fucking cock I'm, and ball if you want. I feel weird <laughs> getting getting involved. You know what? Like this that. is already pretty weird. I I guess I shouldn't be ashamed. This is probably as close as you will come <laughs> to fucking each other. Is slime? I love dude. Aiden's face right now, dude. Aiden, <laughs> dude, it's so gross. It's just <laughs> it's just not a pleasant sight. You need it. You guys come around. Take a piece from that it. side. I was there first. Oh, you went around. I stood up and I looked. Some, some bisexual you are. Oh, this is gross to you. 
Yeah. You know what? Yeah, let's snap this one and put it up on Grinder. See how many swipes we get. Like, I don't... <laughs> <laughs> proof. <laughs> Proof I'm gay and supposed to be here. <laughs> it's just him on the table. It's like a, the third photo. I wanted to see his very red, bloody, flaccid penis. <laughs> oh, my God. You just unlocked a new phrase. Uh, oh. This is, uh, not a lot of people... <laughs> not a lot of people have done this with a, such a huge God, audience. It. I want to let him use numbing spray. Why don't we let women grow their hair out? Yo, based. That's I'm, what someone was saying. It's like Harry P should be making a comeback. Marvin Gaye had it right. <laughs> <laughs> there was a video, really funny. It was this woman on TikTok. She's like live streaming, and then she has like hairy armpits. And her boyfriend walks in the room and lifts her arm, and starts just dogging her. That's like, horrible. That's rude. And he's like, "Yeah, hair in your armpits, fucking." And he keeps going. She lets him finish the moan. He he ends. She goes. You got no fucking job, bum ass, living in my house, my rant. How about you get some fucking job? No lights friends. Lights shit up. Was yeah, the, was lights like, him up. So good. Lights him up, and then and then it, it, she stops, and he goes, "We need to do all that." <laughs> 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 he like starts like he starts twirling the hair. <laughs> I like it. I like I it. I shave my pits when you get a job. <laughs> After seeing him levitate. I yeah. don't want to do this. Yeah, I do turn into David Blaine when like, <laughs> um, she fucking pulls it off. This is the mind freak. Not about it. <laughs> yeah, the next oh. the next podcast episode is you being encased in ice for the entire thing. Oh, this is I think the end of the rope for my ball sack. This is the bottom bottom right quadrant. <laughs> uh. This is the Florida of your balls. <laughs> your your balls split into a political compass. Yeah. This is probably the last time in your life you will have a totally bald cock and ball. Yeah, because if I because yeah, I probably won't do it again. Yeah, I mean you never know. Maybe I'll it's it's easier if you come back soon, right? Like if he if he came oh. back in like a few weeks. You think in like two weeks he's like. I need to call Lana up. <laughs> Got a little hair. Kind of kind of like this. Kind of like this look. Time is the hardest time for you. Has it? And you don't keep up? That's you miss. <laughs> God damn it. That was a weird thing. Because every time, every single hair I got the roots out, a lot of hair not growing back. Mm. So instead of you have 10,000 hair today, next time you have only 3,000 hair. Whoa. So it's hardest the first time? Up? Yeah. The, yeah so the first, the, the first time I waxed my fucking nipple. For, I waxed a section of my leg and my nipples with zipper three because she has a waxing kit at uh, home. And I was like, I want to try this before Anthony does it. The My nipple hair was really thick, but now it's tiny, thin hairs when it grows back. It's hard as the first time. Like mm -hmm. listening to Immortal Technique Dance with the Devil. It, <laughs> <laughs> you always, you never expect Ludwig to be the one to make that joke, yeah. but he gets there. Yeah. I was doing it all Beyblade. I was calling because everyone's calling her. A blades like like uh dances with water or like dragon warrior <laughs> and i called my yeah, dance with the that's devil um, <laughs> it should be dance with the devil by immortal technique. Immortal, well, that's what i call immortal it immortal yeah. technique also a sick beyblade name <sighs> yeah or mind of mencia <laughs> that's really funny <laughs> but my my immortal real technique is a sick name for a guy who competes in beyblade like a gamer tag yeah, yeah. oh yeah! <laughs> Forbidden oh, honeycomb. This is like this is your placenta. This is your placenta <laughs> equivalent. We're looking at a stack of disgusting wax covered in his pubic hair that was just tossed Dude, into it's the trash. The forbidden <laughs> honey. Holy fucking shit, that was disgusting. That's so much. <laughs> That's tight, bro. Don't That's look tight. away. Oh. Don't look away. That's it's for you. So Dude. Gross. I did it for you, Dad. You, oh. you, you birthed that. Dude, it's the best thing you've ever if said. If I planted that, I would grow one of you. <laughs> yeah, you bury that. You'd grow one of my beautiful how, penises. How many? How often do you do this for men? Oh, three weeks. Three weeks to one. Week, three weeks to four weeks. Well, what's the percentage more or so? Like, is it mostly men or women that come in to get waxed? Um, usually women because not a lot of men willing to do this. Mm. But now I have more men come to to oh. see me than before. Like male nursing. It's a growing industry. Yeah, now a lot a lot of men take care of this part now. Mm -hmm. Instead of shaving, go to the gym, you know? So right. The, third, the first time, that's the hardest time. That makes sense. Yeah, the second <laughs> time, the hair will be a lot thinner, less, so very easy. Fuck you, Manscaped. 
yeah. no freak out. No freak no, out. No, I, I think, uh, look, if I can normalize this, yeah, it really hurts, but I'm a smooth bear. Mm -hmm. So, you know, th smooth, there's nothing. Smooth, hot bear. Well, the you're going you're gonna to have to give us the review in like two weeks in the podcast on which section you like being smooth. Because I'm assuming you might not like some sections being smooth and the hair growing back. Sure, yeah. I mean, I think there will be a very stubbly sort of uh, episode. Yep, she's nodding. There was a girl in my high school who had long arm hair, and then she would shave them because people would make fun of her. But then she had short, stubbly arm hair, and I sat next to her, and it would hurt. But I didn't say anything because I didn't want her to feel bad. Did it hurt you? Yeah, because it was like short and stubbly. Like, you know, Why when is she short? touching you with her arm? Because it's like school desk. It's small. Like, it, like it, not, not like a lot. Like, occasionally. Oh, like, like, you'd, arm... like you'd like rub against her is arm? Is it like yeah, biology yeah, yeah, yeah. where it's one big table? It was like it was like desks next to each other. Like, bing, 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 bing. And then, and then chairs. <sighs> My school was never like this. It was close understand. enough that it was something that has happened enough times and that you, it was and a memory. And you'd get hit by a spiky Koopa shell. Yes. And you'd say, yowie. Yeah, and then i go... Mario time. And then I have to respawn in the first level. <laughs> yeah. and fucking... You go back to freshman year. Right. Yeah. And then I have to get back. And I'd be like, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when I was, I think I've already said this on the pod a long time ago. I can't remember, but I'll say it again. Uh, when I was in, I had arm hair like really early as a kid. Like I grew it for before all the other boys. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then. Uh, this is funny. And then uh, I went to school and this kid, Addison, yeah, I have to definitely say this on the pod, made fun of me. And he was like, you have hairy arms. You're hairy and weird. And it really hurt me. I went home and I learned how to shave with my mom's razor in the shower. And I shaved my arms clean. And I went to school and he made fun of me for shaving like a girl. And That's I was right. like, I can't win. You get owned. I can't win. I'm just going to bully me no matter what I do. Yeah. So I told on him and he got in trouble. And I wow. Nice. Narc, bitch. Nice. Yeah. Wow, no, no we backed him to a corner. He deserved it. Her. I was, oh, my I, wiener looks so weird. I started to, <laughs> I started oh. to grow a mustache in... In eighth grade, <laughs> he asked me if I can recognize it. <laughs> only kinda, only kinda. <laughs> I couldn't recognize it. <laughs> this is the only other time it's okay to look at a baby dick. Okay, oh, come, come on, on. <laughs> come on. He's looking great. It's hot in <laughs> here. Uh, yeah. uh, it, when I was in eighth grade, I could grow mustache hair, but I didn't want to ask my mom for a razor because I was embarrassed. Yeah. And it wasn't like a lot, so I used scissors that I would cut my nails. Yeah. And I was doing it, and I got like decently fast at it, so I started going Edward oh, scissor hands in that bitch. Crazy. And then I just fucking lopped off part of my lip, Ooh. and I was like, oh, "You have a scar, still? I think so. I think there's a slightly whiter part right here. Oh yeah, I see it. Uh huh. Yeah. To this day. Oh, oh there it is. Yeah. For that's from cutting my lip, and I put a band aid on it, and everyone was like, "Why is there a band aid?" And I, and I obviously fucking lied. You're like, You're like, like kissing I, girls. I like <laughs> Nelly. What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> my, Susie chomped me. Yeah, like I got we top so good last night. I, I hit the wall because I was fucking in pain. <laughs> but, and, but then uh, someone called me out. Bar for bar what happened. So I did what everyone does. I go, no. Yeah, of course. <laughs> no, you're dumb as fuck. <laughs> Actually, just so you know. You know, I, uh, so I've been like, trying to get back into being active after because my back is a lot better. Right. And... Uh, Oh, yep, yep. And I, uh, I, I, I took a yoga class, and I've never done yoga before, and it was really hard. Ah, sorry. And, uh, sorry. It just really hurts really bad. Oh, yeah, yoga's emotional. I did yoga, and, uh, and it, was, it was really difficult. It was like, it wasn't hot yoga, but it was like very hot. It was like kind of outdoor, like half outdoor. And I was like drenching sweat. And I'm just like trying to keep up with like these agile young women, yeah. And like they're calling out poses, and I'm just like, oh. And it's like it's like a football drill. <laughs> You're doing like uh, what do you call them? Suicides? Like it, yeah. it was very active, and I'm just like dying in sweat. And then ev after it was an hour long session, it was great. It kicked my ass. And then uh, ev everyone turned and clapped for me, <laughs> like it was Aww. end of Evangelion. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it was really funny. Great job. Because are you you were a new member, right? Because I was like, group. yeah, I was new, and I'm like the only guy, and I'm bald. So they probably think that like something's wrong. I love that. Okay, what am I doing? Sit up like that. That. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, and you've seen that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Yin. Oh, poor my. It's Yen. pointing at me. I'm chosen. Oh, this is going to hurt. This is going to hurt so fucking bad, dude. <laughs> What's good about this is I feel more prepared, not all the way there, but if I ever have to see a child get born. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this yeah, is this like, is like mo this is no. most of childbirth. We're showing we're stupid. And it's not and it's not that childbirth can't be that hard. I mean, it's not like a baby's probably head doesn't crowning even, and afterbirth probably tumbling doesn't out. Probably doesn't hurt. So I'm not. I'm not saying the pain. I'm this saying is the pretty visuals. much most of the experience. It, dude, 
Don't that, look away, yeah. That is so I funny. bet it hurts less than this. <laughs> that is so funny. Women who have done both of those things and we're like, we get what childbirth is like. I'm not saying I get it. <laughs> I'm saying I am more ready to visually look at childbirth after yeah. seeing it, to be fair, he was wax entrails uh, of his pubis hair in a hot, sweaty room. We're, we're sitting in 90 dude, degrees. I mint. watched I watched the entirety ah. of a C-section for the first time. Uh, and that what? shit is fucking wild, Why bro. did you watch Why that? Not in okay, person. Like a video. Ah. Yeah. You, you've, been, you've been not home more recently. Yeah, yeah. You've been yeah. gone. Yeah. You keep doing weird baby stuff. I go to You're the drinking formula. You're yeah, watching C-section. What are you doing, what, weirdo? Are, why are you weird now? Yeah, the I, formula shortage, by the way, is really bad, and I'm more mad at you now after learning more about it. Yeah, because I did it. Yeah. It's my What's fault. What's wrong with you? Why are I you doing wait, this? I drink breast milk, not oh, formula. You had both, you said. Oh, I tasted for it. Oh, yeah. French is sweat. I'm so sorry. Yeah, this is fucking... Why, where are you going to do weird... Are you going to baby con? Where are you going <laughs> and you're doing all this stuff? Yo, you guys going to baby con <laughs> this week? This year? The, on my stomach? The, on my stomach? The baby's performing. I think, performing. I think it's, like, it's like my... <laughs> Zipper 3's... Zipper my dick, 3's boys. melee equivalent is is like doula-ing. <laughs> hey, like, man. She's like really into like... Yeah. Like that? Oh my god, dude. you are beautiful. Like that? That is beautiful. This okay. is, <laughs> you, are, you are actually breathtaking. Dude, dude, this is this is like the image that was carved into the Voyager 2 probe. <laughs> <laughs> Yen, Yen has direct line of sight. <laughs> if Yen was like a Metal Gear guy, his, like, his cone is just completely my naked it, fucking hair. It's, it's, no, this is like fucking Star Wars Episode 4, and this is the fucking little hole that he has to shoot as a <laughs> Skywalker. <laughs> Yeah, and you've turned off your targeting computer. What's you, wrong? You look like. Yeah. Oh, I hold. Yeah, I hold my. You right, look yeah, like how look. Uh, people oh. come out of the cryo chambers in space movies. <laughs> oh, this is my gooch. This is literally right beneath my butthole. This is. Oh no. This is the piece de resistance. I thought about this on the drive over about doing this, and I and I, I literally today I was like, if I did this today, I would shit myself. Because I, I haven't been eating well and I've been drinking a lot. And I'm yeah. like, you play beer. And if I get like one ounce of pain, I let go. And I, that's like the worst case. I've had an extremely disciplined eating schedule lately. Oh, there's hot wax on my butthole right now. Oh. Lana, <laughs> wow. Lana, has that's anyone. That's crazy. I feel like I need to see this. Yeah. Yeah. Come, I feel come obligated. Through, brother. Okay, we're all joining. This is like, oh, wow. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, my God. Wait! I'm, don't don't block the the people's view. Dude, the people holy. need to see it. No, they're they're never gonna see dude, this. Uh, I okay. So I I just want to say I wasn't, the wide. I wasn't gonna apologize until now, but I'm sorry, Archie. I I I am, dude. Up until this very moment, I was like, Archie gets paid a lot of money. Yeah, this is like that Vice documentary about the guys in Colombia that fuck donkeys. Yeah, yeah. I want, it's I want like just your face and he, reaction. And he just walks just away at the end. He's like, I thought it would be. When she rips it. Thought it'd be funny. Okay. Yan is braver yeah. than the troops. Yeah, Yen and I are the same. <laughs> hey, buddy, what's going on? Uh, Lana, I'm hold, currently holding my right butt cheek wide open. Huh. So uh, Lana here is going to do pretty much one of the final wax pieces, which is right in my butthole. So, <laughs> so there's hot waxing wax in it. it up. She's waxing more of it. Why is your shirt off? Well, I'm, I'm getting up next. <laughs> Go only my gooch. Uh, I'm so sorry, Lana. Has anyone ever pooped themselves doing this, Lana? Oh, she I just giggled. She a just giggle, laughed. A menacing giggle. Oh. His name's Eric Andre. He's <laughs> <laughs> a lot of shit. Was, was Eric Andre strong or was he weak? Did he did he yell? Yeah, but he just tried to exaggerate for the show too. Oh, <laughs> sure. He's a showman. I'm doing this pure natty, bro. You fake the funk. You <sighs> feel the funk. No, well, he did also get waxed. Getting waxed but taking laxatives before. That'd be so cruel. That would be and bad. And then you pay them $10,000 as apology. Uh-huh. <laughs> no, you have your friend do the getting, waxing. Oh. Getting waxed, but like purposely putting a Skittle down there in your hair for them what? to find. Oh, Whoa. so my bad. Oh, like that guy who has beans in his computer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What? They wax my asshole, but I have a can of beans in my ass. Wait, what? It's like that guy who shoved a, he shoved a toy race car up his asshole and then complained about- This is Jackass. About this is oh, yeah, that was the, Jackass. This is the end of Jackass 1. It was Ryan Dunn. Ah! Ah! You got it. You got it. Oh, you're the goat. You're the goat. Well, I believe right in you. Dude, the Titanic outtakes are crazy. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm bl- blowing a whistle. <laughs> uh, more wax onto the top of the butt crack. It doesn't want to come up. Yeah, it's been there for a- my whole life. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's actually true. I didn't think about that. He's getting rid of hair that's been there his whole life. Yeah, I it's, wonder if the hair is sad. Uh, well, if it's sad, it it gets killed soon, so it it's doesn't like, have to feel anything. Boys, where are we dropping? Finally, <laughs> it's like uh, my butt hair is like, oh, cool, we're gonna take a poop again, right? That must be what's going on. <laughs> Toy Story, but all your hair is uh, alive. <laughs> Every single yeah. one, and it's your butthole hair. <laughs> they're talking about Lana like it's the claw. Yeah, <laughs> dude, I would. Dude, it's the scene where they're all about to burn. Ooh. I thought Toy Story 4 was really funny, and I thought Forky was funny. But you guys don't agree with me. Wait, I, I like, like Forky. Forky. I like Forky four. was really funny. Dude. I thought I, 4 was like a beautiful movie. Everyone here thinks that. Yeah. I said a controversial thing. I said it was my favorite. Of oh, four. really? Yeah, I, thought, I thought, I thought no, I think Ludwig thinks number one is the best, and I think that's Cap. I think one's the goat. Ah! God, Tom Hanks! Tom Hanks! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hanks is the goat. I think ah. I two, <laughs> Tom Hanks. I think I don't get to ah. hold that butt cheek ah. open. Oh, soldier, you're almost there. God damn it! God damn it! Ah. Ah. Dude, he has two per- ah. perfectly symmetrical Y-shaped <laughs> veins on his forehead. I've never noticed. Oh. Yeah. So Lana, look, Lana. Lana looks All like right. she's delivering your, your babies. Your forehead looks like the All Saints logo right now. <laughs> 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 that is fucking funny. Lana ah! looks like she's unclogging a toilet. Ah! Dude, it hurts so bad. This is like surgery, bro. I do feel like I shouldn't be legally allowed to watch this. Yeah, this. Ah! Ah! Dude, this is exactly like the Vice doc where they fuck the donkeys. <laughs> it actually <laughs> is. Did you just fart? No. no. That was him laughing. Oh, it's my butt, bro. Oh, you smell it? No, I thought he farted. Ah! I'm impressed that the room doesn't smell like your butt. That? Oh my god. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't like what I saw. Like, I don't like what I saw. Ludwig, I don't like what I saw, Ludwig. Ludwig, 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 Ludwig. No, 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 I can't look, I can't look. That is for you. Oh, yeah, that's for you, Nick. It's your my little I bear. Can't. There's I a shirt. It's for you. It's for you. It's so gross. Six six months ago, Yan worked Done? for Facebook. Oh, it's my butt hair. <laughs> One in a thousand. What are the odds to eat it? No, no, zero, zero. If you offered a million, I wouldn't do it. One in fifteen hundred. Uh, uh, Three, two, one. Thirteen ninety-seven. One thousand two hundred thirty-seven. <laughs> we were close. Wait, you said one thousand two hundred ninety-seven? Thirty-seven. We That's the close. number I would have said, I swear to God. Are you okay? Almost done, guys. I think it's smooth sailing from here on out. It's just my butt, my normal butt. Dude, I'm toasty. It's toasty. It's so hot. Thank I you think for doing it. You're working while you... There is, a, there is an element of discomfort to this, w- watching this while so hot and sweaty. Yeah, it's it's really warm, too. It's like, it, you know, you touch it, your skin is extremely hot. <laughs> you're like, oh, this is happening it's for like sure. It's like wax by Dove Men. <sighs> oh, fuck. I don't have a reason to be overwhelmed, but I am. I mean, it's hot, right? But, you know, this is how it was in Beyblades. We were hot. It we was hot. I mean, no, we I mean because of your Beyblades. ass. You could also pop your shirt textures. off. Textures. Beyblades was hot, and at some point, someone came up to me, and they were like, damn, it's stinky. I can't believe it. Like, it's craters. And I was like, damn, they're fucking people who are Ugh. sweating all the tuchuses off. <laughs> they don't have special sweat. They're not special bears. Uh, yeah, I think that it was... So beautiful. It was funny that it was <laughs> in a boxing gym. I... I love these little moments in our lives now where people, like, I watch Nick Yingling, the sixth best melee player in Arizona, fight, like, Scara LCS legend in Beyblades <laughs> at a boxing and ring. And Shroud. Yeah, and Shroud, yeah. Ugh. Can I get Can I get a piece of that? Lana? Do you let him do one, Lana? Can I just, can I just try? Do it. Do it. Oh, that one. Oh, maybe not. Yeah. I'll go for the other Ugh. cheek. Let him know when there's a good one if for him. If you think him. there's an easy one that I can jump in and do, let me know. Or you could just do one on Eamon's chest, get him involved. I'm down for that. You can do that if you want. All right, we'll do that. Oh, we'll do that, Ludwig. I think It'll be so... The fans want to see the butt. I'll be so smooth for you. Dude. I'm smooth for you, Ludwig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this the one. longer it goes, the less funny and more sexual and depraved <laughs> this is. Yeah. It's, not even a, it's not even a good podcast anymore. I'm just no. staring. I can't look away. I don't even know what to say anymore. 
Uh, it's just it's gotten hotter, you know. There is a, when it's we like were a at heat wave day. This reminded me Ugh. for some reason when we were at Hot Pot, there was this little TV playing this video of this uh, chef dancing and next to this guy dressed as Tarzan, and the Tarzan guy is about a foot taller than the than the chef, but they're both doing this little coordinated dance as like this <laughs> little music plays in the background. And uh, we're eating, and Zipper 3 looks over at it and looks at Tarzan and is like, that looks like Hassan. And it's like, and it's just this hairless, hulking man. And Dude, I wonder if Hassan got waxed, if he'd be a smooth bear. Dude, he, he it would, would take so much. He's so hairy. Yeah, he's hairy. He's, Tur- he's Turkish hair. Dude, he's so much area. Yeah, like he's his, a bigger guy. Yeah. He would go into the wax parlor, and they'd, they'd be like, oh, we need backup. Like Lana needs to call him like four yeah, you, people. You need to, you need to do OQ yeah. that one. Dude. Lana's literally thinking these fucking idiots. I could do anything. It's a shadow of Colossus boss <laughs> for waxers. Chest is so smooth. Okay, yeah. Okay. Heck yeah. I Here love we go. This. I'm gonna make you feel. So great. I'm literally so go around to the oh, backside. So, so, so to that fucking side. You know sweaty. what? I actually think I prefer you smooth because I'm seeing the part of your butt that's not shaven, and I'm like gross compared to the part that is shaven. Oh, really? So my butt looks oh, nice. This, uh, this side? Shaven butt looks better than unshaven butt, for sure. I will ditto that. I mean, that. That's, that's, what, that's what we're trying to fight against, right? Is the idea that you need to shave, like, your, your vagina if you're a woman, I right? I think it no, looks better. No, we, we need to go in the opposite yeah. direction and get all men to do I this all the time. I think men need to do it, too. We need to shame everyone equally if they have body hair. That's what I think is important. Shame. Shaming. I pull this way? My toots are not shameful. Huh? Here? All right. Then I just pull. Ludwig's about to pull. Pull this side, okay. Is that good? I got some hair. Nice. Yeah, you gotta keep that one. Oh my god, That's, I'm gonna keep that. Yeah. How yeah. much? How much to you eat, eat that, that one? Yeah. How much to eat that one? That one. I'm easy. so sweaty. God, I'm so sorry to all the viewers that are just looking at like again what looks like a baby being born. Yeah. <laughs> with a mustache. Yeah, we need the we have so we have the the YouTube. They made the Patreon. They made the OnlyFans. We just put the full uncut <laughs> gem. They should show this in every health class across America. <laughs> Childbirth is beautiful. I don't care what you said. <laughs> this this is what would happen if we didn't allow abortion. We wouldn't have this. <laughs> this is why abortion's wrong. We need more of this in the world. You know what's crazy is that Maya and Cutie will podcast for like 40 fucking hours straight. It's actually nuts. Because I tuned in last night when they're like three and a half hours deep and they're still going they're hard. Going. I will say they do helps, drink. Right? Isn't chat yeah. Oh yeah, they talk to chat. They got chat and they get hamsky or hamsky, but I also think they just keep it going. It's also kind of streaming. It's like Yeah, I guess it is like a stream. Dude, I went to like a like a food fair and uh <laughs> so I went to like this food fair at the Rose Bowl this weekend. And it's like a big a big place with a bunch of different food. And I was like, usually these things suck. It's just like the food's all shit. But it was actually pretty good. I had like kimchi wings and like Ooh. I had like cheese wheel pasta and like bone marrow, all this crazy stuff. And uh I went over <laughs> And I, there was like this really popular thing. It was like, we're big on TikTok. It like said that on their company. And it's like these, like, they take garlic bread and they make a loaf of it. And then they like shoot like cream into it. <laughs> and it looks like a weird cream pie, from an Italian cream pie. And I was like, all right, well, the line's 40 fucking five minutes. Like a Disneyland ride. But we should probably, we'll just wait. We're here. Whatever. Let's do it. And we go. And uh, we're talking about how good it must be. And there's a woman who I think maybe had a heart attack. And is literally there's an entire paramedic team is called to a woman just laying, kind of looks like li- like slime on the table, just like laying there completely motionless outside of the, of the cream pie station. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I, I was like, they're damn good. <laughs> Wait, was that what the line was about? No, the line was just to eat one. Were people still in line while like yeah, walking while, by while this she woman? was getting stretchered off? That's devotion. People are, yeah. people are seeing that and they're like. Must be good. Yeah, this, like, this shit bangs. This shit fire. <laughs> One yeah. in five people die from this. That's how good it is. They had. They also had like the uh, the how, how long can you hang from the bar thing? You have to do two minutes thing. Uh, it looks pretty hard, dude. I don't want to touch it though because there was no napkins anywhere at this event. Uh, so I don't want to touch a icky. bar that everyone's stepping up to touch. Ugh. Yeah, it's icky and gross and yuck. Wings and I was uh I was at Stan's birthday dinner and me and Cutie got in a little kerfuffle, a little altercation, a little argument. A real one? Or? No. Oh. But but we were like we were still somewhat heated because we were talking about people who die at Disney because we were at Disney and we saw these paramedics. People must die from heat stroke occasionally, right? People die a lot at Disney, uh, and and we we're going around guessing the number just for fun, you know? Because what happens is if someone dies at Disney, most of the time if they get injured, 
they immediately take them off premise so that they can be announced dead outside of Disneyland. So it's not like someone dead at Disney. Because <laughs> they don't want it to die in Disneyland. Well, it wouldn't be the happiest place on earth if... They removed them? Yeah. That... As fast as possible. Holy shit, dude. They move as That's fast as dark. possible. That's dark. They're like, no, no, no. I see him moving. He's talking to me right now, but I'll just keep that guy's him, fine. Keep that him guy's moving. fine. Keep yeah. him moving. He's talking. Hey, what's up, bud? Oh, dude, you like Legos? Sweet. Oh, he's dead. Yep, he's dead. We're off. We're so off. what if you just went and you fucking Bud Dwyer'd at Disneyland? I mean, th- then so they like, have to, they, say they have to acknowledge that yeah. you fucking went down on their turf. There are people who have literally just like been pronounced dead and like crushed by a ride and like yeah, like the, 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 they're like no, that wasn't our that wasn't our ride. And so I was looking up the numbers <laughs> and it was like his was, face <laughs> caved in. It's like no, that wasn't us. That was uh that no, was, no, was, he's he's fucking, good, he's good. We'll we'll California sort that guy adventure. out at uh, the hospital. That's what yeah. we thought. The guy wearing the ears? No, no, he was already <laughs> wearing those. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Oh, did you? Say, oh, so wait, you and Cutie fought about that? Well, because I looked it up. I was like, I was twenty five, and she's like, No, it's worse. I was like, No, it says twenty five here, and she's like, No, 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 no. That's lie. The stat they're they're lying. And then she told me this whole conspiracy theory, and that there's like like hundreds of people who die, but that you don't know. Oh. I do like the idea that she is like, Yo, Disney is fucked up, but I still love going there. But I'm but, still ride or die. Yeah. <laughs> but damn that Peter Pan ride. I like that. I respect that because I, I would assume she was someone who's like, I don't want to talk about that. Turn her that way. Have you guys gone to Disney World yet? No. Uh, I've been to Disneyland in Tokyo. Mm. But is it Pog? Yeah. I've been to Hong it's Kong Pog? Disney and it sucks. Really? Yeah. Is it just small? They have it's just so the small. The little aliens from Toy Story as mochi. That's cute. And you can cute. eat them. Cute. I, I ate one. I don't like mochi. Wah. I don't like mochi Look at either, me. Look at me. I was like... Wah. Right, like a lamb. No, I'm a baby. You're Wah. No, you're actually... Your you baby? actually sort of are in the pose right now where they... like. Take lambs and they like. Uh, this, yeah, like, this is the exact the lamb upside down. This is the exact position I sleep in every night. Really, really. Yeah, I put my hand I, in I'm between my legs. Fe- oh I, yeah, I, on my side. I'm a I'm a side Looks sleeper. Like a fresh I, lamb. I uh, uh, this is what it feels like to get your braces off, but it's your whole body. <laughs> your butthole braces. Yeah. 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 If you had your pillow cube right now, this is pretty much what it would be like in your room. Kinda, yeah. <laughs> you know, temperature wise too. Yeah, you got Funko Pops. You're naked. Yeah. Uh, Gans Sp- there. Yeah, there. Space heater. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, just in the corner. <laughs> no, on. Dude, I, you know, I took a sick picture of Yan. You yeah. ever see my, my cool picture of Yan? Absolutely. Yeah. Me and Yan were walking around, and Yan's just like eating like a corn dog or something. And I'm like, Yan, don't move. And he's like, okay. And you're like, you look so beautiful right now. And it's him throating a corn dog. <laughs> yeah, you look a cool picture of Yan. That looks he's extremely damn, cool. Yeah. He has sunglasses on. I'm like, whoa, you look sick, we dude. We like that. Yeah, that's that's cool. Yeah, oh, God, dude, we're we're getting close to the end. A little oh, a butt fan coming through, coming through clutch. Does that, that feel, feel nice? nice? Uh, yeah, it's like a fan I'm on not your a butt. butt fan, but I'm a fan of. Butt. You should drive like huh? this, naked. Yeah, naked and and and, and afraid. Born again, butt but ass naked and hairless. Officer pulls you. Oh, uh, oh no, <laughs> officer. He's like ah. Uh, <laughs> Lana, huh? Is that is that illegal? Is that She's public indecency to drive naked? Just say you put lemon on your shirt and that you I thought it'd be being, invisible. I think driving on a road counts as being in public. But you're in your car, which is your property. It's like a hundred percent public. Right? I don't know. Because don't they need warrants to search your car? State by state. I think it's a hundred percent illegal if you can ah, see it from ah. outside. So if you're naked and lying down, maybe like you're in your saying trunk, being nude is probable cause. I'm, I'm, hold it? I'm saying oh, God. being nude yeah. is public indecency. Ooh. Oh, he hasn't hurt a lot in a while. I forgot what we were, what we yeah. were doing. You're good. You're good. <laughs> no, I like it. I like it. It's good. Like <laughs> no. the way it works. At I least, just want her to feel bad. I think there was, a, we did this in journalism school for journalists. There was a, wait, there, hold on before you continue. Before you continue, uh, me and Slime, it, oh. in the Patreon, we have a show where we watch Disney Channel original movies, and uh, and we make fun of them. And one of the things in the show, one of the characters is like, what is this yellow journalism? And me and Slime are like, what is yellow journalism? I was surprised Slime didn't know. Not that it's something he should know, but he, sometimes he just knows stuff like that. Uh huh. So I was like, go ask Ludwig, because he's the guy who says, I have a journalism degree. Uh-huh. Go ask Ludwig, and he won't know when we make fun of him. He goes over, and, and Slime's like, what is yellow journalism, Ludwig? And Ludwig's snap new. Yeah, he was playing Valorant with like, r- like real, real big influencers because you know that's what he does. And he just his... knew immediately. So you're a journalist. I'm the only one out of the loop. What is it? It's just like propaganda journalism. It's like what eventually became tabloids, but it was uh. sensational news, sometimes incorrect, not fact checked. And it was like a race between two tycoons. I think it was Pulitzer, 
and then one other guy, I want to say Holmes or something, hmm. and they both had competing newspapers, and so they would just make more and more crazy shit up in the headlines. Pulitzer Pul- has- presumably coming out more credible based on the no, prize. he's not very credible actually at all. Really? Yeah, he just made the prize though. Oh, and the prize is still cool yeah. for people to get. Yeah. What's up? It's the FaZe Banks uh, Literature Award. Yeah, but then, but then he dies <laughs> and nobody's like, wait, that guy didn't know book good. Speaking <laughs> of up, uh, sensationalism... This is the butt shot. I'm doing the wax butt shot. This is dude perfect. <laughs> I just wanted to say that. Sorry. Do you guys think the queen is dead? Yeah. I, I'm oh, kind of yeah. starting to think... No, dude. I mean, we, we said this in kinda, London. I know, I know, but I believe no, 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 it now. That's there was the a difference. hologram uh, recently. The hologram development. No, I'm saying I think she's been dead since we were in London. Dude, we said that'd that be there. crazy. We were like, we were there, and and I was like, Omid is the queen dead, and Omid's like, you don't know Wagwan, and I was like, <laughs> I was like, all right, I don't know what he's saying, but I still think the queen's dead, and that's how the hologram, and I'm like, they Tupac to the queen, she's I think dead, she's alive. Well, you're just doing that to be a contrarian, but I think secretly we all want the queen to be dead because we want we like the idea of the the entire nation of Britain pretending that she's alive. I don't want her They're to be all dead because I watched a TikTok yesterday of one of the queen's handlers and it made me giggle. And it was about how the queen would go to her little cottage in Scotland and Aww. then go on walks and she ran it to two Americans. And they were, and they like struck up conversation because they're Americans and in, in outward. Yeah. And they're like, how's it going? They didn't and know she was a queen. They didn't know she was the queen. So they start chatting, and but it's like a walk that the queen's famous to do. And they were like, wait, you're old. Have you ever seen the queen here? <laughs> and the queen, without missing a step, goes, no, but he has. And he points to her handler because like she like. Oh. He's, and then and then they asked the queen to take a picture of them and the handler. That's really So the funny. queen just snaps a photo. And I Dude, did funny. she do the selfie thing? No, no, no. Oh, yeah, like she takes one of herself. Yeah, Dude, she's definitely not that advanced. I think ge- in general, and I was thinking about this a lot uh, with like British people where it's like, Ugh, that they have like... <laughs> Get it out, buddy. We, hit, we all hit them. They just like have idioms, right? Like they just speak elegantly because I think they, they their language center is based around like phrases and sayings. I, I learned the word for this. What? There's a better word than idiom. I just learned it. It's called an epigram. Epigram? Yeah. No, that's that's Slug's uh, record label. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Uh, but no, it's called an epigram. It's like um, when you say... Th- oh, that's a better definition. When you say things that are like somewhat like maybe satirical or poetic to say a much larger message. Epigram. Yeah, it's like what all of Cronenberg's fucking characters talk like. You're just like, why are all the poor people and wealthy people equally educated in this movie? And it's like, oh, it's because they're all written by David Cronenberg. Big thing in Mandarin. Yeah, it actually is. Really fluent Mandarin speakers will use old, ancient Chinese text in their speech, like regularly. Like I, if we were to whip out Shakespeare, and that's like a proof that uh, you're an advanced speaker. And so I have a, I have a nice big book of Chinese idioms, and they have to learn them. Oh, and that's if you, cool. If you don't spit them, you're fucking dumb. I had to learn idioms in school. You guys didn't have to learn idioms? No, no. Dude. I had to learn idioms in school. Hit the road, Jack. They were like, no, what the they, fuck kind of class hmm. is that? They were. I don't. It was like one of my language arts classes. I had, I had cut the mustard. Uh, I had to learn uh, shoot a breeze. Really? That's so weird. To spend time with someone. That's so shoot weird. A breeze? Shoot a breeze? What a dumb What a dumb class. You would know this if you'd learned idioms in school like me. I also learned cursive in the first grade, not the third grade, because I went to a private school. Oh. Wow. We all hate was, you, dude. He, he typed you the know cursive that. out on his and, MacBook. And then, <laughs> and, then, and then the economy crashed, and I got taken out of private school. I went to public school. We talked my about family this had no money. at lunch about how I would <laughs> never, ever send my kid to private school, ever. Yeah, yeah. I'm public school pilled till I die. You not send your kid to private school? No, never. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, oh my god, the so, plastic. So Slime's like laying on wax paper, like face down right now, as he gets the remainder of his ass waxed, yep. and he he's rotating up, and he's like kind of wet from his sweat. So the wax paper was like wrapped and molded around his penis as he <laughs> That's flipped happened to over. Me. When I went to jerk off and donate my sperm, they had one of those mats on like this exact chair, and that's the jerk off station. Uh, and I was sitting on it, but I was pants down, and then the tissue paper just sticks, and you start sweating ass. a bit. Yeah, yeah. And but then it gets everywhere. How long was your sesh when you did that? It was like thirty minutes. It took a while. Really? To to, to to get it out? Yeah. You can't put one up They're on like, the. Do you want DMX or Adele? You walk in and it looks like an oh old ass melee set. There's one CRT 
in like 80 old ass VCR tapes of people fucking in the you 80s. You didn't have a fucking really? phone? Yeah. That's kind of well, hype though. No, I did have a phone, so I pulled out my phone. But while I'm looking at my phone, scrolling through, trying to find something nice, okay, browsing Netflix, I hear the two <laughs> people at the front just start flirting with each uh, other because really? it was only me in there donating. So they're flirting with each other. It's this was guy it and a girl. Donor? Was it a donor? No, no, no. You could it was beat two off people to work that. There. Oh, yeah. And then Ludwig that. decided, I'm going to get off to love Dude, instead. Dude, what a romantic uh, place to work. If you you're like someone's cute and they, you kind of like vibe and you work at the sperm donation place. It is a quirky Why is this comedy. romantic? It's romantic because nutting happens there. Oh, that's mm-hmm. true. And yeah. that's yeah. where I want to meet my manic pixie dream girl. <laughs> <laughs> my Ramona Flowers of the sperm bank. You know, also like, a cute guy comes in and you can just go test his sperm later and be like, oh, he's... His kid's going to be go, bad at football. I don't want to date him. more salt. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jesus. This is why I season my dick, not my cum. <laughs> <laughs> Lana didn't like that one. <laughs> I mean, look a lot in the eyes when you no, say these no, things. No, no, you have to look no, a lot don't do that. I can't. Oh I like the little fan. The little fan is, dude, you have yellow all over your butt. You look like Tub Girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is disgusting, dude, bro. Oh, I'll yeah, look not... away. It's just the wax. It's not from me. Ah, uh, we got to be close here, right? How much hair is left, Ian? You have, you're... <laughs> yeah, Yan's like, oh, I, did. I know exactly how many Yan's follicles. Yan's, Yan's, Yan's got the time update and the ass update. Give me columns, all right? You got two hairs left on beast height. Dude, I'm looking at his balls. They're so sweaty. <laughs> his gray meat. Come on, man. It's just, not gray. Oh, it, it is. is. <laughs> it's so it's gray. It's kind of gray right now. Yeah. You got it the, looks a little the, dark. The Minecraft zombie meat. Yeah. <laughs> All done? Oh! oh my God. He's a jolly fellow. He's a jolly fellow. He's a jolly fellow. Tony Jason and bald. Wow, this is great. Congratulations on finishing. Oh, what so a fucking sorry. marathon, dude. Oh. Dude, you're going to have the greatest shits this week. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm just staring at your penis. Hey, boys. <laughs> hey, what's up, man? Dude, you're so bald. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at myself for the first time. Yeah. You're bald, oh, you're bald yeah. everywhere. This is what the human body looks like. you turn like. around? Can you bend over a little? You wend over a little. Oh, dude. Yeah, it's sticky because there's no hair to separate it. So it's spread <laughs> open like oh when my, you Dude, when you the sleep. Ludwig tattoo is so funny. It's spread a bit like a grilled cheese <laughs> opens up. No, it's not like a grilled cheese. Oh, yeah, it is. Look. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It spreads over like a grilled cheese. That's a good one. Yeah. What? yeah, yeah, okay. We'll come up and shower. No. Okay. You gotta get a bit of alcohol. I don't wanna watch him wipe his butt. Like, all right, all right, I'll I'm do this later. I'm wipe at, wax out your ass. This is too close. Do it right this now, man. Close. Do it right the now. Hair? We don't care. Okay. I will, uh, I will. <laughs> what's up? You're the health champion here. I You're will, the guy. Uh, what's up, health champions? Okay. <laughs> uh, I will, Lana, I appreciate you so much. I will go ahead. Am I in frame, Yan? Okay. So. Check the white. Is it? Is he in frame? Insane. Uh, so, uh, I, they, guys, thank you so much. We're going to get out of here. It was really, really hot in the room. Thank you so much to Lana. Can we give her a round of applause, yeah. guys? You. I know you got Mike in your hands. <laughs> Lana, you want to you plug you so your much. business you, yeah, one more one time? One more plug for, uh, for your business. Thank you. Thank you for coming here. It's the first time. And really nice to see you guys, to meet you guys today. Oh, thank you so hey. much. She, Especially give me this opportunity. Absolutely, yeah. She's a goddamn professional, and I feel as smooth as a day I was born. <laughs> we'll catch you on the other side. Uh, same bat time, same bat channel. See, See you in the premium episode. Goodbye now. What are you looking at, Archie? <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> That's not for you, buddy. Bye bye. Call it a donut. What that would you is, call it? Wait, it's what not you, a donut. Wait, 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 it's wait, not wait, wait. A circle with a hole in wait, it. Wait, which Dude, place are, are, are donuts you at? That aren't that shape. Wait, wait, there wait, are wait, donuts wait. that aren't that shape. Wait. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Is he? Is he talking about? Yes. Yeah. Think, yeah. Dude, think yeah. about how yeah. many. Yeah. Think about how many donuts. Are